hey, what's going on? You should skip through the chapters of this video to see if there's any Wii games that interest you. They're all games that I like. Check them out. I've never been a big fan of Wii motion controls, although later they came out with these Wii Motion Plus controllers, which are better for controlling the games. But um, we all know the Wii was full of shovelware. That's obvious. We all know it's a lot of shovelware. The NES had a lot of you know bad games. Did you know that? Um, that said, there are games on the Wii that are pretty good, um, and I want to highlight some of the ones that are less often talked about, meaning I'm not going to do any Mario, any Zelda, Metroid, any of that. I like all, I like those games, like I love New Super Mario Brothers and all that, and, but I want to talk about games that are more obscure and whatever. Um, so I did some streams here where I tried out different games that my chat suggested to me, and then... This is going to be games that I personally liked when I was on stream playing Wii games. So there might be more Wii games out there, you know, and I'm not going to play every single, I think there's 1,400 Wii games or something, like, I'm, I didn't play through every single one, but this is just a selection of Wii games that I like. A lot of times I go to throw on a, a Wii game or Wii games and I end up playing a bunch of shovelware. It's like horse games and like games with cats and dogs and stuff and a bunch of crap that I don't like but I know that there are games such as this we're gonna play this uh, boom blocks uh, that I do like so this is all about that so this video on YouTube will be in chapters and you'll be able to go through and be like oh these are all games that Mike likes or you know pretty much thinks they're fun um, so yeah so I want you to uh, enjoy this taste of quality Wii Aim to topple the towers one single throw. Like I said, I've done these already, but it's been a long time. So, oh, I think I know how to do this one. So if I can get it to go there, wait, I bet you if I lock it on right there. Let's see if I can do this. Can I spin it while it's going? You go one, two, three, four. I think that's gonna be a one throw win. And that's what you want. So that would be a gold, right? Yeah, you get a gold. So that, that's the general idea. It's very, it's very simple, but it's, it's a good use of the motion controls, and it like works well. And you don't have to be like constantly doing this. Like once in a, you gotta like do a throw, but it's not like this waving around stuff that some of the games do. That's like way overkill. So let's see what else there is. So this one is. Point blocks. I could try that, maybe. Oh, I haven't done all these. Here, let's try to do this bronze one. Clear the point blocks from the tube. Watch out for a penalty. Okay. All right. I don't totally remember this. Uh, so I guess you don't want these. You want the gold ones, right? Okay. I'm gonna try. I don't. I don't know. I, don't even, I actually don't really remember this that much. So you try to clear all of them. All right, I got a couple out there. How about, what if I do like there? Okay, th see, so this one, oh, that's minus three. So I don't want that. So maybe I can pop, like sort of pop that back. I don't know. Can I get this out? No, I don't do that. Let's do, like there, that's eight. And that's a 10, like if I could get that, that'd be awesome. Ooh, all right, eight. So we got 66 points, I mean, so far so good, right? How about these, let's get that 10. Got the 10, I don't think I've lost any bad ones yet. Let's try to get that. Okay, we got that. Uh. I'm worried about any of these falling off. Oh, maybe that's only if they fall off of the this. I was just realizing. So let's push that off. Get more points. Let's get this 10. Good. I think I'm doing pretty well so far. Uh, now that six in the middle, I think I wanna, should I leave that there? If I can pop that out without it being like, hmm. 
know how I can get that without messing this entire thing up. Here, what if I... I'm gonna try to pop that out. This might be a bad idea. Oh, God. Uh, uh... Here, let's try... I don't know. I'm just making guesses at this point. See, this this is really screwing me here, this, this guy. I mean, I could lose five points for it if I don't hit it too hard. What if I kind of, like... I don't want it to fall off the platform. Oh, God, see, I just lost a couple. Fuck me. Great. Maybe I can... Reverse this trend though and get here. Let's get these 10 blocks. Let's get that one Wait, let me what happened there? All right, I got that Get all these points back. Let's get that. Oh god more are falling. Don't fall off. I Want to get this this 10 off crap That one I guess this just goes until you get all the gold out, huh? Oh, shit. All right, I can get this one gone. Yep. Let's get the four out of here. Oh, crap, I hit that. See, that was bad. Now, now I gotta get this one off. I'm gonna do like... Is that it? Nice try. They don't seem super excited about how I did. Try again. 170 points you need. Shit, that's hard. I'm gonna try this again. Man, that's fucking tough. No wonder I haven't gotten this one yet. All right. What is it? 170 we need. Man. You can't miss too many of these. Good. Good. 58. It's so tough to do this. 92. We can't have any of these gray blocks going off. Now this 10, how am I going to get that out here? I'm doing this like lightly to try to not knock off the gray ones. I'm going to like turn this like this. How am I going to do that? You know what, if I pop it kind of out a little bit like that. Ooh, well that was way more than I thought was going to happen. Ooh. <laughs> and do. That. There you go. So far, so good. So I need 170, was it? I don't want to be too... I gotta be real careful here. There we go, got that one. All right. So there's that six in the middle. What am I gonna do about that to be able to get that out? Here's what I wanna do. I wanna like... Really lightly. That doesn't fuck the whole thing. I'll just keep going. Oh no! Don't fall. Don't have that fall off. God damn it! And you have to get that one in the middle out somehow. It's like here. I want that to go, but it's got to be like. I'm trying to do it as like light as I possibly can. I'm like, here, wait. Don't fall off. God damn it. So that's the last one. Oh, I'm not gonna make it. I might as well end it. Did I let you retry? Fuck. All right, so I'm going for 170 points here. I'm just gonna start this sort of like madness. Let's see what happens. 
see how those all came out. So let's push that all back. I'm just trying to dislodge shit. Nope. Alright, so I want to get 170 points for the gold here. So we'll see how this goes. See this three, I'm gonna kinda of push that back because ooh. I don't wanna lose any of these, that's for damn sure. And that that one's gotta get pushed back. Alright, so far so good. Uh I wanna push this one back just a little bit more too. I think this is good. Let's push him back a little bit. I'm making sure that I don't lose any of those. You don't want to push the shit too hard. See how that almost fucking went. Checking everything. All right, so far so good. So let's try to like. All right, I'm gonna hit this eight out. And that'll make that ten fall. Maybe. Oh, pff, maybe not. Maybe not. All right, how about the eight? Good. Let's see what I can do. See how that's kind of falling. Maybe I can dislodge some of this shit. There you go. Actually, that worked perfectly. I did dislodge it. See, you hit stuff from the other side. Like this, I want to push this guy back so I don't lose that three. Uh, I'm going to try to open this up some. Don't fall off with that. That's pretty good, actually. So, how about this side? Can I hit some of these out? Alright, see this guy? He's gotta go back some. Good. This is actually not too terrible. That's gonna go. Two's gonna go. So I think he can lose like 10 points. Any of these that are falling off, I want to kind of push them back a bit. I don't want any of these falling off. All right, I kind of pushed it back some. This one should be pushed back a little bit. All right, how about this 10? The 10 can go. There you go. Um, the 8 can go. Definitely. Now, see that's 6? That's going to be the problem. I'm going to try to get these out of the way. And then we'll push that, that middle one out. That's the big problem with this. Oof. Pushing that back a little bit. I'm going to push that back a little bit. So let's really look at this. I want to pop this guy out just a little bit. And I want to... Are hard. Ooh, that was a great throw. Wow, I'm getting some real good throws here. So I can kind of like lightly push it that way. So now that's going to be a problem. So see this. What's the best way for me to get this out? I mean, this is pretty clear this way. So if I, I'm going to sort of push this back that way a bit. And this is this looks like it's gonna fall, right? So let's push that back lightly. All right, so this side's like open for me to get rid of that. So I need to sort of push it from the other side. So I gotta be kind of brave here and like lightly hit this. If it's like locked in the right place. Which that's pretty decent. Let's check this. So I'm gonna push that back a little bit. Let's try that again. That's pretty good. There's nothing too bad. See how this is gonna fall out? I gotta fix that. Shit. I wanna get that out. If, if that falls, it wouldn't be the worst, but don't. All right, I lost three, but that's not too bad. I'm gonna lightly throw that that way. Don't fall off, please. I need to get that shit 
out. All right, don't have any of these fall, please. <sighs> Look how that's pushing against that. This is a problem. I need these to like fall, but fall on the platform. <sighs> how about if I like push that down some? Oh God, I cannot have that fall off. How do I fix that? What if it falls kind of this way? Here, I'm gonna clear this platform this way, this side a little bit. A little bit more. All right, so this whole platform is clear. If, if I can get it to fall there. You know? If, if that's gonna fall that way, I kind of need to like hit it from the top, but like as light as humanly possible. Just don't fall off, don't fall off. Thank you. That worked. Just barely, but it did work. And like a light pushback. Alright, so that's good. Now this one's the problem, but I don't want anything getting near that seven. Don't fall off. Okay, the ten fell off. Okay, this is... Don't. Don't you fall. Alright, this is pretty good. So now this... I'm gonna push this a little more towards the middle. A light throw that way, good. And same thing, like I want this to not. I want it to go that way, but really lightly, really lightly, really light, really, really light. Please stay on it. I lost the three, but this might be all right. So I need the one more, which is that 10. If I can, can I like push that off by hitting like these? I gotta be careful about this. What if I have sort of like... How the fuck do I get this out here? like lightly get fuck all right we gotta push i gotta push that back that did not work right let's do that again all right i need to fucking hit this shit just right perfect you know what I want to push this back some. Good. Yes! I think I might have done it. 188? Wasn't it 170 points I needed? I think I did it. It's a lot of, you, you gotta push the minuses, the grays, and make sure they stay on the platform on that one. It's like the, the, the secret of that. Well, you can see that I am very addicted uh, and you could probably just tell how, you know, good this is. And you, you start applying these sort of strategies that you come up with. Um, you know, it's like it's like playing a game of Jenga, sort of. I don't know. Uh, I love this game. I could play it forever, but we got to move on. Do you play L.A. Machine Guns? It's Sega Classic Rail Shooter. Okay. I've never played it. I missed that one. Is this it? Am I in the right thing here? Oh, so they got the two different ones here. So the chat's telling me the LA one's better. I've never seen this before. I don't think. Oh, wait a second. Wait, no, wait. Yeah, I have seen this before. 
Now I played this. Oh, I forgot about this. I, I have played this before. I for, oh wow, I forgot this existed. Oh my god. So does the oh this does something to I'm I'm just saying if anything does anything different like the the B or the so A just shoots and B shoots I guess they just both shoot. So I guess is this an arcade like light gun sort of game in the arcades I, I never played the real machine of it never saw it anywhere if that's what it is. Arcade 3D. Shit. I'm assuming everything's an enemy. <laughs> like this fucking guy. Also, I'm right-handed, but I'm doing my left hand because my right hand is bothering me. This Wiimote shit gives me, like, carpal tunnel problems. That's fine, though. You know what's nice, though? Is it's nice to know that I'm able to do this with my left hand. You would think I wouldn't be able to because I'm right-handed. I'm right -handed. But this actually works fine. I love how all the voices are. Oh! Voices are coming out of the Wiimote. It's funny. Uh oh. Yo, this is awesome. What's the name of this? L.A. Machine Gun or something? I like this. Oh my god. I hope there's not like another move or something that I'm not doing. It probably is like bomb or something. Oh my god, how are you supposed to hit elbows? Oh, you know what? You can just hold it down, I think. Maybe, maybe you can. I feel like it reloads or something, I don't know. I don't know what part of this I'm supposed to be exactly hitting. Is anything? I guess anything. Get him. Boom. <laughs> Mission completed. LA machine guns. Okay, I'm gonna write this down. Is this Sega? Like Oh now I now they want me to do wait, can I do this? No. Here's the part I don't like. <laughs> All right, that this, that shit is only good with like a D-pad when you're trying to enter names and shit. They should just let you switch and use the D-pad for that.
Oh, you don't have to reload? Okay. Yeah, I was like messing with the B button to say. There's like the little meter on the circle that gradually like, I guess, refills. I think you're supposed, it's like a, almost like a refresh. You're supposed to like let it refresh or something. It's like a cool down or something. Maybe. You see, you see like the green and the blue like in the circle? I don't know. There's something, something to do with that. I'm guessing they want you to like release when there's nobody on the screen. You like how one of the games I really like on Wii is actually like an arcade game? <laughs> it's like not an exclusive like Wii thing. Cause with this, would you even count this? It's like, Cause like yeah, it's good, but it's like that's like being like, well, you know what else is good? Uh, the Legend of Zelda, and they also had that on Wii because they had the Virtual Console. It's like, you know, so I don't, I feel like it doesn't even count because it's an arcade game. It's not for for Wii, even though this it's ported to the Wii. Like, are you allowed to put ports? Because I'm making a list here of Wii games that I that I like, but I don't know that I consider this a Wii game. You know? So you, I never played this one in the arcade, but you could go to the arcade and play this back in the day, right? Like, what was this, at movie theaters or something? I feel like uh, whenever I'd go to the movie theater, it, was, it would always be in the lobby. They'd always have, like, the shooting games like this. Be, like, Terminator and Jurassic Park and all that kind of stuff. Shit. Area 51. I played all that stuff. I, they, I always saw the Terminator. That was like everywhere. See, that'd be cool if that was ported on here. continues really fast because that's where you put in your next quarter or whatever, right? I like the graphics in this game a lot. Yeah, there's no way I'm shooting all these out. <laughs> He's got. This is a problem. Finish him! Oh, I, what was he about to do? Oh my God. 
Oh, this game's great. There you go. Blast them all to hell, exactly. Should level up the ones in the beginning more. Here, let's level these guys up. Alright. Fuck is this crystal defenders? I like this. Who knew? Nobody tells me about this shit. They're like, yo, Mike, why don't you go play uh, Gummy Bears Golf? And I'm like, oh, okay. And I try it, and I'm like, well, this is terrible. And then they never tell me about Crystal Defenders. A bunch of assholes, I swear to God. <laughs> Hold the button down to speed up the game if you want. How do you, yeah, no, I wanna know how you, um, you speed it up, but you can also, uh, I don't know if you can, like, stop it in the middle if I want to build more shit. That's the, what I wanted to do, was actually <laughs> slow it down, because they were getting, the guys were getting, like, near the end there. That's why you, you probably have to do it beforehand. Speed it up, I wanted to slow the shit down. <laughs> like, honestly. Robble, Robble says, we are assholes, Mike. Oh, okay. I like that it's Gil as well. This is cool. I like this. I'm going to play more of this. We're going to keep playing this for a while. Next stage, yeah. Engage. 
I want to beat this game. Is a tomato man? What Final Fantasy? Wait. Does Final Fantasy VII have the tomato man? I didn't see the tomato man before, so this is different, right? Or am I doing the same level? Did I pick the same level? I mean, it wasn't a tomato man, right? So I guess it's different. Oh, is that all I can do? God damn it. Alright, well, let's hope that something happens. Final Fantasy XII he's from? Uh, I never played that one. I know, like, uh, the Super Nintendo ones. <laughs> Final Fantasy XII. I tried, I remember trying to play Final Fantasy 10? X, I guess? And it was just like this long cutscene. I had to turn it off. It was too much for me. I like the 16-bit ones. Final Fantasy XII was good. Well, I didn't, I didn't make it to that because I didn't like 10, so I gave up. I guess you just have to pick individual ones that are good. I don't know. I like the ones that are 16, but I can't with the rest of it. Ooh, I'm like, oh my god, you can get that to level 4. The voice acting in 10 made you quit playing it. Yeah, I don't even want that. I just wanted to not even have it. What, what, is, what is that enemy's name? Balky? I swear to god, that's what it said. I, I think that's like what it said. Like seriously, was that Balky? Like perfect strangers, Balky. No, like this guy. Oh my god, there you go. Perfect, perfect Strangers Tower Defense. TGIF Tower Defense. Dude, some fan should make that. I want... Somebody seriously needs to make a sitcom, like, game. Uh, maybe it could be like a Smash Brothers type of game or whatever. Just something. And it's just... It would have to be fan made. Just like all, all the sitcoms from like all time. We because you had there's a home improvement game, but they they never like went into like making games really for like sitcoms. They're really honestly they're like really missing out. Like somebody needs to make like a fan made like sitcom like game and just have like every sitcom character in it. Like when are we gonna get that? Seinfeld. Oh yeah, somebody did do like the Seinfeld Doom. But it's like just, it's not like a full game though. You need to make it like a real game too. Not just like, oh, it's Seinfeld's apartment and then that's the whole thing. Make like a, a like a real game. Look at these. I like that sprite. He's a good. That's a good sprite. Shit. Oh, I'm fucked, huh? What, what else can I do? Now nah, I'm just fucked. Alright, well, like, what else was I supposed to do? Fucking hell. I mean, what else could I have possibly done? I'm gonna retry this. 
Maybe they need to all go in here because then they can, can they hit them on both sides here? What if I put them all here? Wait a second. Let's try this. We're gonna do that. And I'm gonna hope that they can hit them on both sides so I can sort of double my money. Alright, so they're getting them on that side. So I'm gonna assume they can get them on the other side. Yeah. Slimes are immune to sword men. Yeah, maybe I didn't have enough mages, huh? So I'm gonna, I'll put more mages on. Let's have more. And leveled up too. That's all I can do. All right. I'm gonna use the money just to like level them up. That's all I can do. All right. R1 and R2, they were we wear. I think the one, these ones I'm playing are regular. Um, we though. here. Come on. Come on, come on. There you go. Fuck yeah. Is that the last wave? Oh, it's not. Now what about these? What are they? I don't know what all these guys are immune to. What are, are these guys going to be soldiers and then I'm going to be fucked? What if they are? Here, I'm gonna put down some more soldiers. Or here, I'll up, I'll just upgrade these soldiers. All right, let's try it. I don't know. Hope to God. All right, fuck them up. Oh shit, I cleared it. All right, cool. So we're on the third one now, right? Oh yeah, he's moving, he's moving down the line. So this, so this is gonna be a new background, a new uh, pattern, yeah, okay. All right, so they're gonna pass through here like a lot. So let's put. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pass through here too. I'm gonna put soldiers over here. I'm gonna have mages here. I guess I don't know. Who knows? 
stuff some mages. Now I'm just gonna like level shit up. Oh, I can't really yet. Alright, that's as much as I can do. Let's see how it goes. I'm just worried about the guys that are immune. Fuck them up! Alright, I'm just leveling up. Mike found his favorite Wii game. I mean, I like this a lot so far. I mean, that's the point of this, is to find something that I like. I mean, right, so. So how do you speed him up? All right, the sword, guys. Alright, I'm gonna do another sword. Let's have four sword guys. I'm gonna try to level them up more. You mean the point of the Wii is not to torture yourself by playing through as much shovelware as you possibly can? That's what I thought. Oh, you hold one of them down. All right. Oh, so A pauses it. Oh, okay, it's one. One speeds it up. Cool. All right, that's helpful. Speeding up is great. Resistant to physical. Okay, so we want to level up the uh, these guys. So let's make these strong. Damn it! How about the top guy? All right. All right. I think that's enough to handle it. I don't know. Barely, right? Here, I'm gonna put another one down here. Oh, it's done. Oh, I'm done. Okay, that was easy. Uh, I love this game. <laughs> I think this is fantastic. There's, so there's two of these. So is this regular Wii or is this WiiWare? Somebody said it was WiiWare, but I think this was in with my regular. So is it both? Like, I don't know. So you're saying it's WiiWare. Both of them are? Uh, okay. As somebody who's unfamiliar, what's the difference between Wii and Wii Wear? Um, Wii Wear was the one, it had like, you know, like Contra and Gradius and all that. They were like more simple. Oh, look at this, I got a new guy. I'm gonna put one, one of those down. Here, let's have, let's have two of those guys there. Let's have, we'll have a nice uh, arrangement here of a couple different things going on. And then maybe I'll have regular soldiers here and here. I'm going to put a regular soldier. Oh, that's all I can do. All right, we'll see how it goes. Okay, so the regular soldiers do well against the spiders. 
Okay, I want another regular soldier there. And... Let's have somebody good here. Let's, I'm gonna put another one of those down. All right, I don't, I don't know if I wanna put any more variety down. I just wanna like level up. They need to be more powerful. So this, so this is considered Final Fantasy? Or just kind of in that universe? Is it like spiritual successor? How do we like define this? It's just like in that universe kind of? Spin-off? Is that how we can say it? They come from Final Fantasy Tactics. So it's kind of like a Final Fantasy Tactics spinoff, sort of. So they took Final Fantasy Tactics and kind of like, they're like, we can do a tower defense on Wii with this, basically. It's it, so it's in the universe that Tactics advance and 12 were set, okay. Gotcha. You know what I want? Make this game. You make three of them. You make one for Final Fantasy 4, 5, and 6. Dude, a Final Fantasy 6 game that's tower defense like this? Because those are the characters I know. That'd be a great, like, hack of some sort to do. physical. Alright, let's up the... They're not getting by that shit. You're not getting by that shit. Or maybe he is. Hold up. Fuck. Okay, there we go. That's the last one, right? No! Ice guy. Uh-oh. Maybe, maybe these guys are good against them, who knows? This, this is the shit you gotta learn. Oh, they're, I wrecked them. Mm, better be careful. Right. Resistant to magic. All right, my like physical defenses are not hot here. Oh, I just used like everything on that guy. Oh boy, I don't know. It's resistant to magic, but I, I wonder if that like totally, oh boy. Fucked, huh? Can you sell? I don't think you can sell, huh? Fuck. Maybe you can later. Oh, I'm fucked. Yeah. I'm fucked. Damn it. You can't sell units. Okay, it's not like that. All right, so I didn't have enough physical. 
Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do this. <laughs> what was that? What kind of stream was I doing tonight? Uh, what? So I need more physical attack, guys. For sure. I'm gonna make it through this. And I know they gotta be like leveled up more and whatever here. I don't know those like monk ones if they were really any good. Pit beast. And not make anybody else. Just like level the shit out of all these guys. Like maybe one more physical guy. Oh, that's all I can do. Fucker. I know one of these is like, one of these waves is all about the magic enemies, so I can't go too weak on them. So th this, this is the wave actually here. All right, so I gotta, this is where I'm gonna up my magic, guys. Who's the other one? This guy? Is he? Yeah. Alright, that's as much as I can do. Alright. They gotta go around the other side, though. That This will take him out, right? Yeah, alright. So now I should be doing physical attack stuff. Alright, uh, first guy in the row. Boom. Made him really strong. Let's up him. I think at this point I'm pretty much just focusing on the physical attack, guys. Uh, there's only four of them. And they're all I need 25 at this point. Level 37, holy shit. Should I do that? Resistance to magic. These are the guys that are gonna be a problem, so I don't know. I'm gonna like spread them out more. Hope to god this is enough to do this. I don't know. I should have I should have had more over here. I kinda now I kinda wish I could sell more. I'm gonna put another put a soldier there. I don't know. Uh-oh. This is not good, hang on. I'm gonna lose this again, huh? Did they like, where are they? Oh, they're over here like fighting. They walked all the way, wait, what is their range? Oh, they can walk further than I thought. Okay, well that's good at least. I should have made more soldiers here. Dude, I fucked this up again, huh? I'm very upset. I don't know if I'll make it, maybe? I mean, he's finishing off quite a bit. God damn it. Maybe you can lose a, can you lose a couple of them at least? Oh yeah, seven. I made it, just not well. At least I made it. So you can go, you can go back into this obsessively. Like I could try to, try to do that again and not lose any. Come back to it later. So we have to go. The, I'm hoping there would be another map beyond this. There has to be, right? Monks might have helped more on that stage. Yeah. 
please beat this game, says Boopy Pants. I mean, now I'm, I mean, I like this. All right, so where's like the sort of chokehold here? Like, here's a good one. So let's do some soldiers, and we'll level them up pretty strong. Um, I mean, this guy could... Mm, if, if they're in here... Oh, yeah. Like, here's pretty good. Make sure they're, like, in the middle. Let's have, like, that. How about a, how about a monk? And, like, a... Do, like, that. I don't know. I'll try that. I mean, I can get both sides there. If I do this. So, we're gonna do another mage. And then a, a monk. I'm just having a good like variety. And then a soldier. And then, then I'm gonna go down the line and level them up. Fuckers. See that shit? And then they'd get hit again if they made it to the other side. Who was that? The cockatoo something? I gotta make sure I'm reading what it says before each thing. I'm not skipping by it. Hit beast. I'm just gonna see if we can take him out. They can get that. Yeah. Jelly. Resistance to physical. Alright, so we want more magic. Or let's level the magic guys up more. And let's get another magic dude here. Alright, that's a little better. Nice. Sweet. What's the next? Airborne. That looks like a guy that's in uh, mystery, one of the mystery dungeon things. Like that guy. Ooh. Oh, they almost fucked me up. All right. Uh, could level that. Fuck them up! Fire Drake. Fuck them. Good. Luck. Lunch. 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 O pan. <laughs> Who? <laughs> I'm about as good as reading the names in this game as I am at reading the names in the chat. Ice Drake. Alright. And they could still make it around to the other side and then those guys would attack them again. I, I fucked that one up. It's because I found the right place to put the enemies, or the, not the enemies, the exact opposite. The right place to put my guys. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Step on the Beast 82 for the uh, sub. Okay, so how do I make sure this is saved? That's another thing. Um, it's probably auto saved there, right? It's gotta be auto saved. Better be or fuck it. I just unlocked a new unit, did I? Shit. Oh yeah, some like bunny thing. I guess, do I have it now? Oh, oh, archers! Ooh, I like that. Let's put some of them in. I'm gonna go for the same kind of thing I was doing now. I felt like the, I mean, the, ar the mages were like ranged too. That's all I can do. All right, let's do this. 
As long as I have a good variety. And they like, they want me to have these archers on this one, I'm sure. How about an archer here? All right, I'm just gonna like level them. Yo, I like, I love this shit. You guys ever played Defense Grid? That game's really fucking good too, for tower defense. I like it at least. How about this one, can I, there you go. I like how you can speed it up. You know what I love about this game? There's none, there's none of this. It's just like normal. Like honestly, I'm gonna be completely honest with you. That's what I want. Oh, archers can fuck them up pretty good. Nice. Little blob guys. Airborne, ooh, I'm worried about these ones. I'm gonna do that. Hope, hope to God the archer gets that one. Hey, working pretty good. Pretty decently. Let's level you. Standing out here by yourself. I gotta watch it. I gotta make sure my other people. I can't only rely on the archers. We gotta make sure the other ones are pretty decent too. Let's get him leveled up. I got at least a strong mage and a strong soldier. I'm gonna keep on with that. I'm gonna do this. Wow, I'm gonna put him, I'm doing that. And then, oh, that's as much as I can do. All right. Ooh. Ice Drake, all right, so, let's see. How about these monk guys? I'm gonna, I haven't really been leveling them at all. Should I have a strong monk for once? I'll do that when I can. I'm gonna, uh, resistant to magic. All right, so, soldiers, monks, there you go. Those are a new enemy. There you go. Is that the last one? No, it's not. Axe beak. Now I'm gonna do archer. Dude, that's like a level six archer. What are you gonna do versus my level six archer? Die? I bet you're gonna die. Fuck you. Now, anybody else? Resistance to physical. All right, so we got level up archer, level up. Let's level up the magic guy a little more. All right, boom, boom, boom. Ooh, um, hang on. Uh, shit. Uh, it's so expensive now. Here, that one. Is that the last wave? Oh shit, it's not even. Wow. I don't have like no money, huh? Fuck. Fuck. Oh my god. Alright, I'm gonna put somebody else down here. So, who's good against them? I don't even know. Or should I just like level these guys up more? Maybe I should do that. Should I rely on the monk for once? I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna rely on the monk. I don't know if this is the worst idea. That's a bad idea, right? The archer, I guess, is not even doing that damn great. I'm gonna... Oh, I can't even level the archer up again. I'm do... I'm gonna do the mage. Alright. 
Come on. Is that the last one? Motherfucker! I only have three left. Isn't that a cigarette? <laughs> Marlboro? Um, alright. I have a little bit of money. Here comes bad, yeah, bad breath. Uh, yeah, I guess I could put more mages in. I guess the monks aren't helping me too much, huh? I thought these archers really were gonna help me more. I'm gonna try to level, I'm gonna level this mage up more. I put another, it'd be a weak one, but. Oh, I can't go anymore to the left there. Alright, so. Oh no. Alright, now I can level this here. Oh my god. Oh wow, one. Oh, I made it with one. <laughs> All right, so the problem there was I didn't have enough mages. I'm gonna, I wanna do that again. I can do that better. I'm gonna, I'm gonna straight up retry that. I can do this better. So yeah, mages. Mage. No, no monks. We're gonna have archers. I should have some soldiers, but I need more. I need more mages. Do another. Archer, another soldier, mage. I'm gonna do this shit. I'll put another mage. We're gonna have a mage here. Are they not good against these dudes? Or I'm just too weak. Oh, they're good. They're just weak. All right, let's. I'm gonna level this shit up. I'm gonna. The problem is, I'm gonna not have enough. There's gonna be one guy that's gonna come out. It's gonna be like, I only am resistant against whatever. Um, here, let's do. I'm worried about the soldiers not being good enough for when that happens. Because there is, like, I think there's one wave that you need resistance to physical. So this is another mage thing. I got plenty to upgrade here. Oh, he, he, did, he was barely upgraded at all. I know I got a lot of, like... I can spend a lot, but... Okay, they're doing fairly well on that. I got a lot of money to upgrade. 107 fire. Alright. Mm. I don't know if, if the magic is that like, great against them. What did the fucking thing say? You like my amount of money? Um, here, I'm gonna level these guys up a little bit more. Yeah. Fuck them up. Alright, Ice Drake. I'm just gonna let it go and see like what happens. I, I need to like memorize what works on what. I think the magic does work pretty good on them, huh? Let's level this guy up. Should I do it again? Oh, I can almost do it. I'm gonna do it again. Is this not working too hot? Here, physical attacks. Alright. I, I didn't fucking read it. God damn it. 
I totally didn't see it. I missed what it was. Keep doing that. Fuck. Oh, so these physical guys aren't even going out to it. This must be, like, maybe this is where I needed the archers. Hold up. Can I put more archers in? Because I definitely had more archer stuff going on before. That's probably where I'm making my mistake, I think. Oh, I fucked this again, huh? God damn it. I'm fucking dead? Motherfucker. Who's weak against them? Yeah, the archers. I didn't have enough archers. I forgot about the damn archers. I'm gonna... I'm gonna do this. <sighs> Alright. Black mage. Archer. Man. My archers were like fucking shitty as fuck. I'll get this. I'll get it eventually. Now I know that my archers need to be like leveled up better. I totally forgot about them. You can't do that. You can't forget. So like one round you need to like have them really leveled. I'll put an archer. I'm gonna put in a black mage too. Archer, black mage. What am I not really protected on very well? No. Damn it. Soldier. One more soldier. Alright, I'm leveling black. The mage is up more. These guys. All right, so mage, archer, 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 mage. Okay. I haven't figured these guys out really. Oh, pretty good. Oh, they fuck them up, hardcore, fuck them. Go for physical? Okay, yeah, physical attacks work pretty well on. Again, a little further than I wanted. Oh, yeah, the l l Mr. Lunch Man. I'm gonna, alright, I'm gonna, now I'm just like, maybe I'm overly concerned about the archers now, I don't know. There you go, that's fine. Ice Drake. See, and the Ice Drake I forget. I have to like write this shit down. Um, what didn't, what worked and what didn't work? I guess I'm about to find out. So, okay, physical, physical attack is working here. Kind of, here. They're gonna get them. Okay, pretty good arrangement. Yeah, here we go. All right, so. I'll level that up. I'll level her up when I get a little more. All right, now I can do it. They're fucked now, I think. I think, I hope. There you go, that's better. Now what? Axe beak, fuck. Uh, well, let's see. The physical attacks is working pretty well against them. Can I level them up? I'm gonna level them up again, because that's working pretty well. Jeez. Alright. Oh no. 
Oh, resistance to physical attacks. All right, so I should up the magic guys now. See, this is only level seven. What do you got, 25? I hope this doesn't want archer only. Oh boy, oh my god. Uh, I don't know which one's doing better, the archer or the, the mage. Alright, I got 59 here. I'm gonna do... Uh, I could either up one of the... I could either up the archer or the mage. I don't know. You think the mage? Alright. Booby Pants thinks the mage. So I gotta do... Or I could do that. I'm gonna do that. Oh, shit. Alright, I'll try that. Come on now. Nice! Oh, this guy! Let's see. See, my thing is, I don't know what, what thing... Everybody's hitting him, I don't know what thing is like working the best. You think mages? Alright. See if I can do another upgrade for a mage. 25, I'll do that one. I hope, I hope. Come on, baby, come on. Yeah! Is there another round? Oh, my, oh these things, the Marlboro guys. <laughs> okay, so, this is what, these guys like killed me before, right? These, I think this was the upgrade. No, the, the like, the fairy things were the upgrades for the archers. They want it. Ooh, this is not going well, is it? Put in more empty space up and down. You mean like in here? Oh my god, uh, thank you Mr. Zilla007 for the sub. Uh, no, I have never even heard of that game, Mr. Zola, but thank you for the sub. Are the physical attackers doing well? Like, this is not going well. Maybe I could upgrade the mage more. I could upgrade the ones at the end, I don't know. 37, I guess it doesn't matter, I'll upgrade this one. Let's see if I can get one of the ones at the end here. 37, almost. Now I can. Come on, please, please do something. All right, a couple got through, but is there any, is that the last round? That was the last round. All right, so I lost three, but that was pretty good overall. I'll take that. All right, so, um, yeah, I'm, I'm happy with that. All right, so we made it like halfway through this. So what I want to do is, um, I like that. So that's Crystal Defenders. Definitely like that. We was trying hard for the casual non-gamer audience. I don't, well, I know that, but even if you're not a gamer, you still wouldn't want to be doing that. Hey, at least it told me. Right up front. Good. Fine. That's fine. It tells you right up front. Okay, that's a good sign.
they made it easy to save it, not like some of these games. Uh, that, all right, no complaints yet. Fine. Can I skip it? No. Oh, it's a short little loading thing. I thought, okay. Is an invisible but powerful force. It can slow. Oh, you can skip the cutscene. Wow. So you think you can keep it together? Keep your winds spinning? A simple dust devil couldn't possibly throw that massive pumpkin gun out. I'm gonna wait by that pumpkin and see if we have ourselves just a little dust devil. Or if we have something. The wind warriors have agreed to surround you with a wall of wind so you don't get burned by the sun. Okay. Oh, we are the tornado. Okay. Ooh. Hey, this might actually be neat. supposed to be doing exactly, but we'll, we'll see. What is this one called? Tornado something or other? Tornado Kingdom or something? <laughs> so you just wreck things with the tornado? <laughs> nice shot. Looks like we have a new target. Let's see if you can get strong enough to pry that cat get strong enough. So, what do you get stronger by just ripping up stuff? You know, this is pretty cool. I need to rip up the trees. Yeah, this is neat so far. There was no bullshit. You just fucking start. And I didn't have to, like, a lot of these, like, Wii games you turn it on and you have to, like, go through all this bullshit and, like, sa savings and all I was playing one earlier. I don't know. I don't remember what the game was. But I go to enter my name and it's, like, all this weird shit and, like, the lines are like this and, and it's trying to, like, do this shit and I'm, like, trying to go like this to enter, like, to put M in for Mike and I'm, like, doing this and it's, like, Jesus, do you need any of that shit? It's like, if you want me to enter my name, let me just do it with the D-pad. It's like, oh, let me get it to, on the thing. You know. Anyway, this didn't have any of that. I don't know exactly what I'm doing here. I'm assuming I just wreck stuff and then that gets me more powerful, maybe? I don't know. I like these graphics. Kind of like blocked off there. Can I get the people? Oh, here's this like cannon thing. Oh, I got the cannon. Sure wor wor world's largest balls. They're about to be surprised. They came to the right place. Okay, oh, we can, we can wreck this whole... Um... Oh, and the fireworks are going off. This is, this is cool. I like this. Let's see what happens. I, I don't think I'm strong enough. Here, let's get more stuff. I, th I think that's what's happening. Ooh. Now let me try. Now, yeah. To see some true power. <laughs> like Paul Bunyan. Thank you, uh, is it Columbo1994? Appreciate it. He says, I had three month 3D sub baby and it's yours.
Okay, thank you. I always got like an old West Town you rip up. See, this is more my speed. This is like what I would want. Tur turn the game on, tear some shit up, and then turn the game off. <laughs> you know? It's like... Everything's so over the top. Oh, ooh. Wasn't that the thing I needed to get? Whoa. I'm a wind warrior. So you're like the character inside the tornado. Let's rip up the dinosaur park. So is this this is a little like um, a Katamari, you know? See the tornadoes growing. I don't know if it like it decreases too though. Can I get this thing? No. It's gonna have to be big enough to get these big dinosaurs if I'm even able to do that ever. Oh wait, do I have some kind of special move? Hang on a second. I thought I had like some other thing I could do. I guess not. I thought there was some kind of like charge attack thing. Ooh, ooh, yeah, get it. Now we're talking. Go get the other one. Get him. Ah. Fuck yeah. Okay. Get this, get this. I don't know if you have to do it quickly or if it stays. Like your power level. All done. That's cool. So as you go through the stages, does the tornado just progressively get bigger and bigger? Are we gonna be like taking out cities by the end of this? <laughs> That'd be great. Is it loading? What's happening here? Oh no, I guess we're still going. You can't go past that. But if I get close, if you get close, you, you can still like take out the stuff that's on the outside edges that you can't go to. Okay. What about this little guy over here? All right, let's just exit. Zephyr's mission lock. I don't know. I kind of like this. this is all right. Anybody here ever played this before? It's time to step down. And hand the reins of the squad over to. Hang on, I'm getting ahead of myself. Destroy all life. And my it's great. I, that that's the that's a plot that I can get behind. It's part of the rite of passage. It's like with the Death Star or something. And you can skip it. Mike is a fan. I mean, so far, it's fine. Tornado Outbreak. Chicken farm. Why don't you come over here and fuck up the chicken farm? All right, so we did that, right? Is this the next thing? Guess so. Looks like a Saturday morning cartoon from 2008. I, yeah, it does actually, doesn't it? <laughs> See that barn over there? Go fuck it up. <laughs> See that barn over there? Looks pretty big now. Fuck it up. Let's find and find and destroy shit. Ah! <laughs> Remember you can do that in Link to the Past? 
Oh, you have, you have Link go after all the uh, all the chickens, and then the chickens attack you. So this is just like Link to the Past on Super Nintendo, don't you think? That's what, that's what I was thinking, at least. Same, pretty much the same. for a game. I, I think this is fantastic. Who made this? I don't know who made it, but I'm down. Yo, imagine you, you, you can make this with, like, even... I mean, the cartoony graphics are cool, but... Remember when I was playing like Mech Warrior 5 and you know and that the oh what happened? Oh, I went into the sun and it fucked me up. I was saying like imagine like a game like this, but it was you know had like the graphics of Mech Warrior 5. Okay, okay, so we don't want to go into that. Can I take these out? Ooh, we can get those now. Ah, I can't get to that. Get it if I stay on it long enough. Oh, get it in there. Get the tree. Get the tree. Fuck it up. Can't can't get that. Can I get this guy? Ah, fuck you. Ah, <laughs> Your pickup truck is fucked. <laughs> I love this. Yeah. Oh, the horses? Or is those sheep? I will take down every tree. I want to go out there. They won't let me. get this level up higher, get, get up to level 8. Damn it. Can I take these out yet? Nope. How about this tray? No. How about this shit? Yeah, there, that's what they wanted. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. I'm taking this out too. Everything goes. Everything's gotta go. Oh. 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 Oh.
this is great. This is great. A pl I'm writing it down. A plus. A tornado outbreak. We got another one. Turn the camera angle up. Uh, next. Oh, uh, that's the end of the level, I guess. Or no, we're in a new area. Uh oh. Whoa. Once again, road size. But they will not be salute stars only enough power to generate this protective shadow for a limited time before it must be charged. See the timer up here? Oh shit. So I gotta do this shit quick now. Alright. I never saw so many eggplants in my life. Alright, we got five minutes then. Level two. Out of the way. Sunflowers. Eat them up. Don't forget to chew. Can't get you yet. Where do I go? Where do I go? I, I don't know. Shit, man. Out to this. Can I get out there? Oh, here we go. I to do it. There you go. This commentary. It's the best commentary I've ever done. Who needs to write scripts? Uh -huh. Oh, that's the other guy. Uh Can I get these now? All right, two minutes. Shit. All right, let's see if I can get across this. Will it let me? Here we go. There's a bunch of stuff. Come on, get it. Hope I make this. Shit, 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 shit. There's gonna be a tight window. I don't know if I'm gonna make it. Level nine. What do I gotta be? Level ten or something? Can I get this? Can I get the silo thing now? Oh, I can take out these silos. Ooh! Thank you. Can I get across this? Yeah. Oh, I can go across that now. Ah! Come on, baby! Yeah! Eat my shit! Eat my shit! Boom! That silo is toast. Fuck him up! Oh, what's this? Dude, are we gonna fire tornado? 
All my dreams are coming true. I can control a fire tornado. What are these fire guys, though? It's like, okay, I'm grabbing them, but what are they gonna do? All right, I got them. Grabbing and absorbing fireflies in larger numbers can recharge the load star's timer. Remember to grab as many flies as- Oh, they give you more time, I guess. If you're running out of time, that's that's what they want you to do. So we're gonna, so eventually we're gonna destroy a bunch of shit, and then I'm gonna be low on time. So I gotta, do, I gotta do that to have enough time to get through the levels. I guess it's a time thing. All that practice to good use. Absorb 25 of the fire flyers hidden around this campground to open the load star. You will need to grab and hold as many flyers for bonus points. Stick around after the load star portal opens. Okay, bonus points. I don't care. All right, let's see. Make it to this next one. Oh my god. Get to the next one, get to the next one, get to the next one, get to the next one. Come on. Escape, get, optional, get 50. Sure. Why though? It's for points. Now I'm going for points in this game. Flyers with the grab. Let's put all that practice to good use. Absorb 25 of the fun. Motherfucker, is it because I didn't fucking lead? Oh, I should've just fucking left. All right, well that's fucking stupid. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna, I'll do this again. I'm leaving. Alright, that's 14. What is it, 25? Suck him up. You've got to keep absorbing. Motherfucker. <sighs> I didn't do it quick enough. God, fucking damn it. Enough. Come on, suck them in. Let's go. Suck it in. Suck it in. Suck it in. Amazing. There, I did it. Get me the fuck out of here. Either escape now or. Yeah, I would like to escape. Where's the exit to this thing? Right? There's got to be the exit, right? Fantastic. Now you. Yeah, get me the fuck out. Oh, oh you could stay for more points, but then we're gonna. If you fuck it up, we're gonna restart the whole thing from the beginning. Looks like it's time for a real mission. Absorb 50 flyers in this area and head toward the load star. Once we've done that, maybe we can get down to who is behind it. So I have to become a big tornado first, I, I assume. Okay. 
I like it better when it's just the regular missions or whatever, like this. Oh, there's a flyer. Absorb 500 flyers! There, that's a couple. I mean, it, it is kind of making it look like a fire tornado, though, when they're all going. See, I wanted the tornado to light on fire, and then... You could like light buildings on fire because the tornado is on fire. I don't know if that is that maybe that's kind of happening. Those actually these buildings kind of are going on fire, aren't they? Sort of. Like that's on fire. Or no, that's on that's on fire first. Look, I haven't even been over this building. They're, what they're saying is that's there's gonna be flyers in this building because the building's on fire. I'm not the one lighting it on fire. See, I want to be the one to light the building on fire with my flame tornado. <laughs> That's what I want. Why isn't it like what I want? God damn it. No, it's cool though. I guess. Can I get this building yet? Not yet. Gonna run out of fucking time. Did I do it? There, now I did it. You got 50 flyers, locate the star loader, you're ready to leave. Sure, where is it? And I have 58 seconds to find it. It's like a purple thing or something, right? Shit, don't go into the sun. Couldn't even see it. Oh, there it is, I see it, I see it. All right, good. Totem? Fuck them. What the fuck? Wait, what is happening? I can't. What do I do? It's not letting me do anything. I can't even move. Is this like broken? What? Oh. They want you to do this or some shit? It's the first time it's made me do that. Zephyr's mission locked. <laughs> all right. And then all I had, like, l literally all I had to do was go like that, and then it was like, yep, that's good, you're good. Okay. I guess that's a boss. <laughs> what? Fucks, Bill. Fuck us, Bill? Like, seriously. Whatever. Let it be. Come on down to fuck us, Bill. Entry three. I don't. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I have no idea what the fuck is going on. I just want levels. I just want to be able to go around and destroy shit. Just let me do that, please, game. Please let me do that. Ooh, ooh, a graveyard. Let's take it out. Whole thing, every one of them. Here lies Mike Matei. 
man baby gamer fuck him that's where my grave would be too fuck us Bill that's where it's gonna be so if you're ever looking to piss on it now you know where to, where to go <laughs> now you know where to go Where I, that's where I will be. Look at this area. What the fuck? Is this gonna be? Oh, it's one of it's these guys. Am I supposed to be collecting them still? Oh, there's that machine. So that machine is by whatever. All this shit. We gotta get to level eight. Destroy the docks. Can we go through the water? Oh, you can go right through the water. Whoa, it's the sunlight. I want the tornado to get bigger so I can take everything out. The end, the end of these rounds is the best when you can just take out like basically everything. So now I have 58 seconds to get to the star thing. What, what, what if I want to destroy every single fucking thing though? Which I do. I'm staying longer. We're gonna, go, we're gonna take this right down to the wire. Cause now this is where the shit gets good. You gotta stay. Cause this is where you can destroy everything. Oh. Cause this is what you want the whole time. 19 seconds, shit. I wanted to get this to level 11. Oh, I got it. All right, I gotta get out. All right, we made it. <laughs> now the first totem should surface any second. There it is, by the water tower. Good, we're making progress. Did you just see a bra, like, hanging on a, on a line? Probably. here to witness this moment. Yes. I'll move on to another game. Let me do one more, and then I'll move on to another game. Oh, we got Lawn David the Gnome. Look around you. There are many things to see that some would say should never be. These things I know it's true, and I will tell you so. Going now. Mini tornado. Oh, here we go. Let's get all this shit. Oh, this isn't doing anything. Barely. I need more than that. We need. Here we go. This will. This will work. Trolls and wizards and fairy kings.
Who knew that David the Gnome was going to be in this, on top of everything else? Yeah, now we're getting somewhere. Okay, there's the machine. take those out yet. Probably gotta be level 8, level 9 maybe. All these cars that are on like fire. Let's go back up here. I mean, I guess the thing is, is you don't want to finish out getting all the, the fire guys because that'll like end it. You kind of want to wait on that, I guess. Cause was it? Is it 50 of those things? There we go. Oh, now I can do this. Oh God damn it! Why is it ending now? I don't want it to end. Damn it! I thought you had to get 50 of those for for this to come up. This is where you want to have time. See, I want to get this thing to level 12. Come on, let me. Or can't you get extra time if you get more of the fire things? Or so I thought. Shit. I'm not really sure how that works. Let's see if this adds it to it. Suck, him, suck it in. Oh yeah, okay, I just added like a little bit of time. All right, I guess I'll leave. So, so I was adding time. Just, just, it's just that you're not adding like a ton of time. What are these? What is this? What? What? Do I go through all of those? Okay, I guess I did it. Apparently I did it. All right. Jeez. Squadron, as you approach the totems, 
Watch out for the sunlight. Running into the sunlight will cut one of your warriors. If you lose your entire formation, with capes. I guess that's where I'm supposed to listen to the story. I could play more of this, but I probably should stop playing this game. It's fun, though. I don't know. I, I like it. We'll see. I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I've never played it. It might be awful. Let's see. All right. So you're like a bird or something. Let's just start quickly. Chapter one. Let's just look at this real quick. Oh wait, what? Move the pointer while pressing A. Pull the vines. Oh, oh! Stretch the vines skillfully and carry. I mean, that could be, if the controls are good, it might be right. Okay, I'm good. Stretch the vines skillfully and carry Ivy along. Okay, let me play. Oh wait, go back in the other direction. Here. Oh, oh, you do that to change the direction. This actually kind of motherfucker. This might be all right. See if they don't do something to ruin it. What is this game called? Ivy something? Ivy Kiwi? Alright, so far so good. It works. Unlike half of the shit that I try. <laughs> I mean, like, really. Oh, there's like a flying thing you can get or something? Wait, I wanna try that. Give me that, give me that. Turn around. I want that. What does that do though? I got it. Oh, are these just collectibles? I thought it makes him fly, because he's like a bird. I think 
it's just a collectible. Four of ten. Do you have to get them? Maybe you have. Wait, what if I walk up? Here. It's not letting me. Okay, so it wants you to. Oh, no, wait, I ended it. I thought. Okay, I was thinking that it was gonna make me get every single one of them. It doesn't. Okay, good. All right. You could probably go back through the levels, I guess, and. Does it disappear eventually or something? What the? Oh, look at that. I didn't know you could do that. Is there a way to take it away, though? Or you grab like the edges of them or some shit. So I'm like trying, I'm getting the hang of this still. This works surprisingly well. If only more games work this good. Like this is what you would expect for like a motion control kind of thing like like this actually functions Go, get, get this this is hard God damn it I can take it away Hang on. I gotta figure out how to take these things away oh you grab it like that all right It's not easy though. You, oh, you kind of do that kind of shit. I take that away. There. Right? Oh. I'm bad at it though. Oh. Fuck, I'm having a hard time. What if I do that kind of shit? I need to do more of that kind of shit. There, get the fuck. Oh, fucker. <laughs> Piece of shit. The fuck up there. There we go. Jeez. I'm learning. Slowly. I don't care about that. I just want to get to the end. There, good. Are we good? Oh, it's like timed? Oh, god damn it. I didn't know it was timed. That's hard. Fuck. I mean, the better you get at the controls, it probably gets easier. I like the, like, drawn sort of look. feathers, but I'm just like, whatever. I don't fucking care. I just want to get to the next level. I, I don't know if I'm going to be I don't know, fucking myself by not getting them. That's probably half the point, you know? Chapter 5. You think there's any kind of like enemies or bosses at some point? I wonder. There, got it. 
I'm gonna go. I'm, I'm gonna go get the other one. Let's try to get it. Okay. Ooh, we can do that kind of shit. Okay. Oh, you can go like that. Oh. I, oh shit. Fuck. Turn around. What a fucking idiot. Damn! Oh, look how it's like drawn. <laughs> Shit, imagine getting all these. Wait a second. Some of these. Alright. There you go. Now take it away. I'm having trouble like with when you get rid of the thing. Like you can somehow. I don't know. I don't really taking it away is a little hard to do. <laughs> oh, and they can do that shit. That's kind of cool. It's like, it's the B for that. Here, I do like that, and then... <gasps> turn around, turn around, idiot. What's his name, dumb fuck? Oh, dumb fuck! Kiwi the crazy some shit? Crazy Kiwi? God damn it. And see, now I'm trying to get the feathers, so I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm, gonna get, I'm just gonna go to the end. some fucking hot shot with this shit. I, I really like the idea, the, the controls and whatever are really interesting and kind of unique. I, I mean, I don't think I've played ooh, anything quite like this. i played a lot of games. the top of a step for that to end, to end, I guess. Interesting. Chapter two gets harder. I don't know. You sent him to his death? Yeah. Um. You like the look of the game, too? I mean, it's kind of cool. I like how it's like, you know, it's like actual like drawings. It's neat. The controls work. I'm assuming it's gonna get harder now. Fuck, whoa. No, turn around. Motherfucking piece of shit. Going where you want? You don't go where you want. You go where I tell you to go. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? You dumb shit. Here, get that out. I don't understand how to take them away well. Or maybe it's just timed or something. Alright, got that one. They might just sort of dissipate after a while. Maybe that's the problem. I, I thought like, I was taking them away, but... Mario? Wait, what? Oh, he can walk on that shit when he's got that shit. I see what that shit's trying to be. Yeah, you, you, he's got to step on the top of any of the steps. 
Okay. I wonder if it matters if you you need to be standing on top of the top step. If that matters at all. Points or something, maybe. Now what? What the fuck? <laughs> God damn it. There. Motherfucker. So what you do is... You gotta just, like, s stretch it out as long as you can make it. Fuck, hang on. Alright, that's like that, that's like that. Let's get him up here. Good. Oh, good. Like that. No. Go back, dumbass bird. I do like that kind of shit. That was better. This is kind of definitely like the more you play it, the more the controls become easier to handle and more intuitive kind of thing. I can tell. Oh, all the way up top. I'm, I'm like gradually getting better at it. Yeah, I definitely, I definitely think I like this one. So, all right, I'm glad I put this on. Okay, so this is a house of the dead. Oh, see, I was playing something earlier on a train or something. It didn't feel like anything. This now I feel like I'm actually shooting things. Here we go. instantly works. No bullshit. It's just good. You know? No, no fucking stupid shit. God damn it. <laughs> I kept reloading at the wrong times here. Oh my god, he's on fire. This is shit. Motherfucker! It's a green thing. I shot it. Oh, slow motion. something like on the ceiling or something too.
guys that were coming like down the hallway coming after me too. I'm gonna reload. Combo lost. Motherfucker. Uh, oh, oh, uh, what? Oh god. <laughs> Damn it, you gotta be really fast. That's cool. Yeah, this is, this is great. Shit, shit. Want that? Oh, that wasn't a zombie in the toilet. That was <laughs> just a fucking person. Dude, eat my shit. Eat my shit, I said. You listen to me, I told you to eat shit. Oh boy. Save the civilian. How about that? How about that? First shot. Ha! Oh my god. <laughs> this is fantastic. Is this only on way, this one? Or are they taking this from the arcade? This is taken from the arcade, right? I have to assume. I mean this, ver this overkill thing, I mean. I know House of the Dead. I had, what I had House of the Dead on it? Uh, Dreamcast? There's House of the Dead and Dreamcast. Shit. I fucking hate these songs. Mutants. How many times have I... Oh, no arcade version. Thank you, Count Droncula, for the sub. Does it let me, like, pause it? Yeah, hang on a second. <laughs> let me catch up with you guys for just a second. Jeez. It's, like, impossible for me to, like... Does the noise come from the Wiimote? Yeah, a lot of noises come out of the Wiimote, yeah. When is Pac-Man? There is like a Pac-Man game on here. I think somebody mentioned one earlier. This was ported to PS3, okay. They're saying the PS3 version's also pretty good. Did the PS3 have some kind of light gun? I don't think I've ever done a light gun anything on a PS3. Was it this exact version, Mortal Guy? I feel like it was um, something else. Because I've done other videos of regular House of the Dead, but I don't think I've done this one. It's better with extra chapters. Oh, is, is this, the, like, just extra chapters? The PS3 dildo thingy. Was there a dildo for PS3 that you'd use to kill zombies with? PS Move. PS Move? I don't even remember that. PS Move? I'm looking that up. Is that the dildo? Oh, that thing. <laughs> I forgot that existed. Oh my god. <laughs> That's funny. PS move. Wow. I haven't thought about that since it's back then. Alright, let's keep going. Lock. God damn it. Come on, you gotta be fucking kidding me. What the fuck was that? I need help. We're on an express elevator to hell going. Shut up and press the button. Oh. I guess 
this is at the end of the level. Is that the end of the zone? Are you okay? The act? No, I am not okay. You would never call it a zone in a game like this, right? What does a zone work for? For like Galaga or something? At the end of the zone. <laughs> Sonic. Oh yeah, there you go, Sonic. Somebody is forced to watch. Oh, these guys table. <laughs> forced to watch oh, my streams. These guys ain't you. I've never seen this kind of crazy shit before. All right, so what's the game plan? You restrain. Hey, that's fantastic. I like that. Interrogation. Fuck that, Columbo. Shit to me. <laughs> Okay, well that's awesome. That's going down. So I'm writing down. I don't think I played this specific version, so this is overkill. That is great. Like I that's fantastic. There you go. That's a good one. Alright, this is Geometry Wars Galaxies, and I can play this with a classic controller, the Wii Classic Controller. <laughs> Which is always nice. I like the games where you can do that. I should just look, look up games that you can play with that. Like, honestly. Um, I'm old school like that. So, I believe this is a twin stick shooter. It's been a little while since I played this. I have played this before. But, uh, I don't even remember. So, okay, so I move around with the left and shoot with the right, right? And then I think you got bombs. And stuff like that. And stuff like that. And you gotta stay inside the box. Stay in the box. Stay in the damn box, Mike. Just turn the music up a little bit. Here we go. I also played, there was another Geometry Wars game, uh, Dimensions, maybe? I think that might have been, like, on Steam or Switch or something. I think I like that, too. All these kind of games, uh, these Geometry Wars stuff, I, I like all this shit. So let's play this for a little bit. I mean, I feel like this is an obvious pick. I feel like people have played these before, so... Um... But, still, not as famous as Mario or whatever, so it should be on here, just in case anybody hasn't, you know, played these before. I actually don't think I streamed this one. I think I streamed Dimensions, but not this one, so... I don't know the whole history off the top of my head of Geometry Wars, but, uh... They're cool, they're cool games. I don't know when they, the last one they made was, but I feel like this is something that a lot of people have played, though. Fairly uh, well-known. Now, this isn't a Hidden Gems video. I used to do those. I did NES Gems and Super Nintendo Gems and all that. This is It almost feels that way a little bit, right? But more just me like trying out random stuff. Shit. And this is also unscripted and live streamed. <laughs> so it's not quite like what I used to do, but a little, a little bit of that looking for gems flavor. Ooh, boom, boom, boom. I love the way they, it's almost like fireworks going off. It's very beautiful to look at. Boom. Boom. 
I hope that space, like real space, is actually just like this. What if this is the reality? What if it's just like this? Actually, that would be kind of terrifying. No matter what way you look at it, taste is a... <laughs> taste? <laughs> oh my god. Mm. Taste. Um, space is always terrifying. So is attempting to speak while you're playing a video game. Also terrifying. Probably more terrifying. Maybe not more, but quite a bit. I, heard, I was watching something on space earlier, and uh, one of the astronauts was saying that if you were in space without a spacesuit, your blood would boil because of the, uh, the sun hitting your front side, and on your back side, because that's hitting regular space, that would that side would freeze, so you would, you would freeze to death, and you would burn to death, and your blood would boil like all at the same time, like all in an instant. Freeze to death and burn to death at the same time. Like that's, I never even thought of that before. That's horrible. Like actual actual space is uh, not not nice. Guess we're, we should just stay stay on the planet and go to uh, uh, Coles. Yeah, go, just go to Coles instead of space. <laughs> And this stream has been sponsored by... No, it's not. <laughs> oh, God damn it! Well, there we go. I got some points, I guess. How was that? I felt like it just went on forever and ever and ever. Was that just, like, endless? Are these all endless modes? That was trainer. Okay. Well, what else can we do? Um, where do we go next? Let's go back. Can I go to another planet? Oh, I guess I can't go to another planet. Metal targets. Can I go to another level or something? Because we get three lives. How do we get to the next level? Oh, and there's all these other things. I'm just on that. I'm like so at the beginning here. I guess I didn't do well enough. I guess I'll do this again. I don't know how you get to the next level, exactly. The, the, I don't know what you call it, the menu or the level select is a little odd. I'm gonna do this again. Can I figure out how to get to the next level? I, I figure I just didn't do well enough. I'm gonna do it again. They're like eyeballs. So silver is, uh, 1,250,000. So what do I have? 44? Alright, we gotta beat so If I get... Do you have to get gold to get to the next level? I wonder. So what would that be? Like, 1 million... A million and a half or some shit? So we need a million and a half? Yeah, no problem. Let's see what I can get. And what's the other little guy going around? I don't know. I'm sorry. See, this is... There you go. This is not a review at all. This is, I don't know what I'm doing. Me testing out games. So here's the thing. So a lot of these games that I'm playing, um, this is this is very much for me so that I can come back to this video later and be like, all right, I went through lots of games and this video I know is specifically for me to look at and be like, okay, these were all games I personally played, and I know that I, I enjoyed them when I was playing them. I gotta tell you, so I've been, I played some other games too, like off stream, because I've been going through a lot of these, this Wii stuff. I played that firefighter one again, the real firefighters or whatever. I didn't really like it, that firefighter game. I know that one's supposed to be good, and I also played the, the, the marble game. Uh, like Marble Mania, not Marble Madness, but Marble Mania on the Wii. And like that's supposed to be like alright, and I tried it and I didn't like the controls on it at all, the way you have to like twist the controller. Um, so I mean I have been trying other stuff as well. Um, so now I have 1,200,000, come on, I'm trying to get... I can't blow this shit up, I'm trying to get... Oh, and I'm not using my bombs, I need to use them here, I'm gonna use them. Fuck it, let's just use them. 
one million three hundred thousand. I'm just doing it again. I don't know if you get more bombs or what. Or maybe every time you die it refills or some shit. Score times 32, huh? Fuck him. Fuck him. What are we gonna do, John? Rambo in space. Hey, they never did do Rambo in space. When are they gonna do Jaws in space? There's a Jaws Wii game and it's very mediocre. It's not terrible. I tried that too. That's another one I tried. Um, look, looking for Wii games. And the Jaws game... Uh, it's just... It's not... It's not terrible. It's not the worst thing. At least your jaws and you're like eating stuff under the sea and all that. But it's just, it's not quite there. But uh, I've seen, I've seen worse. It wasn't good enough for me. Like I wouldn't sit and play it, honestly. But uh, it wasn't the worst thing I ever played. It, was, like, it wasn't a bad game, just not good enough that I would want to actually play it. So I thought I'd tell you about some of these other games that I've been trying out that you're not gonna see in this video. Cause I'm cutting out all the crap games. So that, so that when, you, when you're looking through this video, it's all stuff that I enjoyed to some degree, you know? Because people shit on the Wii a lot. I mean, people shit on everything, right? People people really terrible to the end, Nintendo 64, you know? You notice that too, how much people like don't like the Nintendo 64? I think there's some really good stuff on there, personally. Um, I mean, like anything, there's a lot, there's, there definitely is a lot of crap, but there's a lot of good games on Nintendo 64. Is that my last life? I got another life. So I have two million. Oh, gold is three, three million. Shit. Well, I don't know if I'm gonna make gold. All right, so I don't have any bombs left. You, so when you die, you do not get bombs back. So I made it to two million, three hundred thousand. So all right, I didn't get gold, but Let's continue. Now does it let me go to another planet or something? Oh yeah. So that's trainer and that's that's the next one. There we go. The the way they do this is it's, it's, it's a little weird. And look at all these other things. There's like a shield thing and all this stuff. This is very I have a feeling that this is a very deep game. Oh yeah, so now we're on new level. All right. I might have already unlocked this before. I was just, I think that that menu is like just like weird. The level select, I should call it. So bronze is six hundred thousand. So I'm sure. I guess as long as I do bronze, it'll unlock the next planet. I'm guessing. See, this is the kind of thing. Be like, I could see myself getting like really into this. So like maybe later, and if I happen to watch this myself later, hi Mike, see I'm now I'm talking to myself in the future, you might want to do a full stream of this. This is all just, it's a sampler palette for myself to do full streams. I kind of, it's sort of the same thing I did, I did for Steam games, I played a bunch of those, sort of like played, played a bunch of Steam games that I own for like... 15, 20 minutes, something like that. I was like, all right, just testing out a bunch of games. And then I went back and I streamed some of them, like Mighty Goose and Donut Dodo and whatnot. So same sort of thing here. And what's nice these days is YouTube added uh, a feature that you can do these chapters. So if you're watching this video, you can just, you know, if you're bored, li listen, if you're bored watching me do, uh, you know, this, uh, Geometry Wars, go to the next chapter. You don't have to sit and watch the entire thing. You know, just skip through, and maybe you'll see a game that's more interesting to you than than this game is, you know? That's sort of the point, is, is just to sort of jump around and be like, oh, this game looks cool. Let me watch, you know, two minutes of Mike playing this game, and then when you're bored of that, move to the next one. I don't, I don't expect anybody to sit there and watch every single second of me doing any of this. In fact, I'm surprised that anybody watches any of my material. <laughs> to be honest with you, this is mostly for me and for my own, my own purposes, so that you know I can 
find games that I like. I've always, always, always been interested in finding just obscure games that I like. And I have my, you know, obviously, you also know that I have my weird interest in playing crappy games sometimes, but I gotta be in the mood for that. Sometimes I want good games, and sometimes I want crappy games. And a lot of times I get interested in playing the, you know, obscure good games. And then there's other days where I want to play Mario, you know? I have those days, too, where I'm like, I just want to play good old-fashioned Mario or Pac-Man, you know? So I'm, I'm all over the place. I'll play good games, bad games, famous games, <laughs> obscure games, all of it. I am. I'm all over the place. The only thing that I really don't like is boring games. I'll play, like, a bad game, but it, if it's bad... But entertaining. It's like a movie. You know, they're like so bad it's good and kind of, you know, like Troll 2. It's a bad movie, but it's entertaining, you know? It's kind of like that with a lot of these things, if you don't quite understand. There's a lot of there's a lot of games that can be kind of like that. So like so bad it's good kind of stuff. Jekyll and Hyde is very much a so bad it's good type of thing. At least it has that. But then there's other games you know, that are just flat out boring, those are the worst. Those are the, those are, you know, it's very, it's very similar to movies in that way, you know? Can you think of movies that you just like, straight up, like there's, there's, if they're not even funny, they're just boring, they just, it's, there's no redeeming qualities, like in any way, you know? You don't have to leave a comment about that, I don't really care, because I don't want to watch <laughs> I don't want to watch. I'd rather leave you leave a comment about uh, you know what Wii games are out there that uh, you know I didn't play that you wanted me to play. But yeah, I do want you to realize that I did play a lot of other games that you're not gonna see in this video because I'm gonna like not include them or I'll edit them out or whatever because I want this video to only be stuff that I like. And me, and me personally, like, maybe you, you think Geometry War sucks. Like, I kind of like this game, but I, I'm a guy that, I like twin stick shooter games. And you know what, you might be like, oh, there's all these cool fighting games or something like that, but I'm not really a fighting game guy, so you're not gonna find any of that here, you know? So my list might not line up with, you know, your interests at all, really. I might have totally different interests. Some, sometimes, you know, I'll have friends that suggest games to me, and they'll say, oh, you gotta play this game, because this is the best game. And then I try it, and I'm like, eh, you know, it's all right, but, you know, because everybody has sort of different tastes and flavors. So this is just what I like, you know? And if you like other, you know, you have other types of games that you like, that's fine. If they're not the same games that that I like, you know? Uh, I mean, you'd be totally wrong. No, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just fucking around. Um, but yeah, so this is cool. I'm just seeing how many points I can get here. Should I use another bomb? I think I'm gonna, oh God, I'm out of bombs. Okay, I, I'm not, not gonna use another bomb. I'm in trouble. This is very worrisome. Oh, damn. Well, can I get, can I, maybe I can at least get silver. I think I already got bronze, at least. Oh shit, I got fucked there. But did I unlock another level is what I wanna know. Let's see. Trainer. Or there's like another, wait, so there's two, trainer EIS, trainer duo. And then that, and then that's it, I guess. If I hit back, can I go to another planet or anything? No, I'm still in this like solar system. So I can only go to... I don't know if I went to this. I guess I'll say... I'm going to see if I went to this level. So I did this one, right? This looks like... Here, I'm going to quit that. So that was the EIS one, right? Crap. Yeah, so I'm going to do Duo. Let's try Trainer Duo and see if this is different. I think I might have unlocked it. Yeah, I don't think I've done this one. So this is now Trainer Duo. So I guess I'm unlocking these. So, so far, all the names are weird. 
Couldn't the names be something I could remember? I was like Trainer EIS and Trainer Duo and whatever that planet with the C was. Planet Cunt. <laughs> Couldn't it be stuff I could remember? Like Planet uh, Gadget, Planet Elmo, Planet um, Brown Bricks. Hey, I'd remember it. Planet Batman. Planet Rygar. Do you know what? Do you know there's a Rygar game on uh, Wii? I haven't messed with it yet, but uh... Oh, you know what? I put it on and I think there was a bunch of like cutscenes. And I get, I get very impatient with the cutscene stuff. That's just... I'm like, I'm really impatient with it. Unfortunately, you guys know that. I'm just... I, I'll slip through very, very brief cutscenes, but like they, they need to be skippable. And I don't want to get on the cutscene thing again, though. You guys know my feelings on that by now. If I, if I still have to explain cutscene, my feelings on cutscenes at this point, I don't, I don't know what to tell you. I even did like a blog post on it once. It's just, you know, it's just very annoying to me. And you know what's really weird to me is how. It seems like almost everybody else has more patience with it than me. I wonder if there's anybody else out there who has less patience. I, you know, you can't have less than zero, though. I would say I have, I have more than zero patience, though. There are some cutscenes that I don't mind. I like the Red Dead Redemption cutscenes. I like the Ninja Gaiden cutscenes. Um... And I like cutscenes that you can skip. <laughs> yeah. You know, uh, okay, we just got bronze, and that's about it. That's the might be it. the Pac-Man cutscene. Yeah. Old arcade games did cutscenes right because uh, in between the round, like the little character would, would just like run by real quick, and then you go to the next round. That's that's a cutscene. This like 20 minute, you know, fucking bullshit. Yeah. I just can't. Let's get off this subject though because. I've been over that a hundred thousand times. I would just, I'm trying to get silver here. Fuck. I don't know if I'm gonna get silver. I'll try. I, I love this though. Like honestly, like this is something I would play the fuck out of. As if I'm kind of not already, but I wonder like how far this goes, like, how long would this take to, to do every single, like, level and challenge and everything, you know? Fuck. Like, this is definitely something I would want to explore on like, a couple live streams at some point. Someday, and that doesn't mean that might not happen in 2022, the time I'm recording this right now. Maybe by 2030, I'll have gone all through Geometry Wars, you know? I'm sorry, but I can't get to everything immediately. I wish I could. I wish I could. I wish every day was 200 hours long and then I could get a lot more done, but unfortunately, uh, is it, do I have some kind of obsession because, do you like how I like play video games like every day for like hours and hours and hours and it's not enough? I'm like, well, if, if every day was longer then I could play more video games. That's what it's like, that's, it's a, a problem. I'm addicted, huh? I'm addicted to video games. Yeah. It's definitely. <laughs> without, without a doubt. I know it. Hey, there's there's worse things, right? I guess. Is there? Maybe there's not. Maybe that's the worst. I don't know. It's an addiction, man. The good games are, at least. Alright, so I got bronze, at least. Let's see if I unlocked anything else. Alright, so now... The duo. Um, that one... And EIS. These are the only ones I can go to, I guess, huh? All right, I'm gonna go back and see. And none of these other ones unlocked. I think. I wish it would tell me more. Like locked, locked, locked. So I can go to that. What do I have to do to get another planet or something? I wish it was a little more. For forward with that. Select a planet to battle on. Some planets will are free, but some will cost geomes. Pick them up during battle. Oh, is that 
the problem. I have to like buy them with those. Wait, how many do I have? Well, 116,000. So, oh, maybe if I just keep playing, it'll unlock more because I'll have more of those. Is that how it works? Shit. Interesting. Um, let me see. See, now I just want to sit here and play this. I'm going to play this a little bit more. I, I, would, I would just like to figure out how the planets work. So I didn't get what, uh, I got like bronze, bronze, and all right, I got silver in that. So let's not do that. Let's do one of these. I'm going to do this. Let's do this again and see if I can get the silver. And saying collect these little geome things. I'm going to see what those even look like. I didn't even like really realize. Um, is that that? Oh, okay. I didn't even know. So these little yellow things, you're collecting those. See that right there? There you go. I just sucked one in. I'm good at that, aren't I? I'm good at sucking them in. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to pay more attention to sucking. And then as those go up and I get more of those, I guess that's how I'm going to get further and unlock more things. So I guess they, your, your geome level, let's see, like your currency, 220. I don't know if you're like literally buying the planets or just like if your amount is higher, then it'll like automatically unlock new areas or what. And you know, I know there's probably a guy who like knows this game inside and out already. He's probably watching this. And if you're frustrated because you're like, God damn it, this is a basic mechanic. Why don't you know? I don't know, man. I'm trying to figure it out. I always assume there's a guy who's just yelling at me. Cause you know what? About one fifth of the time, there there probably is. You know, like honestly. I will say, you know what I never do? I never acknowledge the 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 you know all the nice comments that I get, <laughs> which there are very many. I do get many more nice comments than I get the asshole comments. So to all you people that are nice, thank you. There you go. You, you got you got an honest thank you for me for you know coming to my streams and leaving nice comments and not being complete fuck faces. Thank you, all you people. Now, as for you other motherfuckers, you listen to me and you listen good. <laughs> it's fine. Hey, look. It's it's fine. I get it. I get it. You have a small penis. That's your problem. I understand. It's under it's understandable that you would be so upset with me. <laughs> Um, no, just kidding. I, uh, what I meant to say was I love you. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for the constructive criticism. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> so, I have 870 geoms now. Geoms. Is that just supposed to be gems, but they're trying to be fancy? They're trying to do the Zelda thing? Like, it can't be... It's it's rupees, you know, not rubies, but rupees. It's got to be cute. You know, God damn it. We don't do that around here. Just call it what it's called. Call the snake a snake. It's not a rope. Damn it. How dare you try to be creative? How dare you attempt creativity around me? You know that I'm devoid of all creativity. I mean, that's not too far from the truth, don't you think? I think. All right, so we're getting diamonds. This whole level is a diamond. You know what those things look like? So not these. So there's these like spirally purple things. One of these things down here. Uh, see all these these guys? See all these purple things? They look like the. Um, the player piece in the board game Crossfire. The thing that I spin away on is motherfucker Mike. 
The thing that you shoot with the little marbles, that's what those are. I wonder if that was the inspiration. Were, were they thinking Crossfire when they designed this stage in Geometry Wars? Did I just crack the code? Probably not. It's just a little shape. They're like, no, that's not what it is. I'm sure the people that made Geometry Wars for the Wii are watching this right now. What are the chances that that's true? Hey, if you did, if you worked on Geometry Wars for the Wii and you're watching this, please leave a comment. I would, I would love to talk to somebody that worked on the Wii. That would be very uh, unique and cool. And I would have to say, whoever made this is a hundred times smarter than I will ever be. I don't know how to make a video game. I'm very stupid. Very stupid. And uh, I don't know how any of this works. Or how any of this comes to be. <laughs> you think, like, I would know anything about making video games? I don't know any of that. Very, very little. I mean, I've watched some documentaries about making video games and stuff, but I don't know a lot. I did not do well, but I got more geoms, so maybe that lets me go to another level. Let's see. So, no. I still have not unlocked another one. Well, I'll have to figure that out later, I guess. Let me go back. Can I get to any others yet? Boy, it takes a long time. I probably have to, like, beat... Um, I, I gotta do better, basically. But I would love to play more of this game. Um, I like it a lot. What is your favorite Geometry Wars game? Is this, this sh is this one, do you guys consider this one shitty? Is there a better one that I should be playing? Or is, do people consider this the good one? I really, that's something I really want to know. What do people consider the good the best Geometry Wars game that's ever come out, I wonder. All right, well, we're gonna move on to another game. And oh, and once again, this game was, you can play it with this controller, the classic controller, which is very nice. So this is House of the Dead 2 and 3. I'm gonna play some House of the Dead 3. House of the Dead 3. I remember the Wii Motion Plus controller screams and yells at you too. It's funny. So let's try this one out. And if you have any suggestions for Wii games that you think I might like, let me know. Specifically me, because you know I'm picky. <laughs> you know. Run. Run. So here we go. It's some late night House of the Dead. Oh, that's right, and we go off screen to reload. Like so. Are we the only ones left? No one's responding. And you can skip the cutscenes. Believe it or not. I don't know if you can shoot these like glass tubes at all. We can't let everyone's death be in vain. Sometimes you shoot like barrels and whatever else, and you can get like upgrades or bonus points, whatever. I think those guys throw knives at you, or they they try to anyway. Don't let them. Don't let them do it. Zelda dude is here. You're first today. Ooh, scratch at me. Stay out of my way. Are those, uh, like slime men? Slime men. That's difficult to say. Slime men. <laughs> How many of these things are they ever do a movie, like an old B horror movie, on a slime monster? I feel like there is one. I am the slime monster. We found Thank you, D3Gun, for the sub. Hacks2000 says that this game is great. Another good rail shooter for the Wii, yes. Thank you, uh, oh, slime people. Henry Bear, good boy, thank you very much for the sub. 
Thanks, guys, for the for subbing. Appreciate it. And Kaiser V Man also. I'll never give up. I'll never give up. Have I done the Resident Evil rail shooters? Oh yeah, there's like the um, Umbrella Chronicles. I forgot. I should put that down. Is that considered? Would you guys consider that too famous? I'm trying to stay away for what for what I'm doing in this stream at least. From like, I'm not gonna do any new Super Mario. I'm not gonna do Metroid. Resident Evil is a pretty popular series though. But you know what? The, like the Umbrella Chronicle stuff. I feel like that's a little less talked about than like the main series stuff. So maybe, maybe we could throw that on there. I have played that before, and I remember liking it. So. That's not a bad suggestion. Ooh. Oh, I forgot that I keep forgetting to shoot these barrels. Reload, reload. Oh, that coin. I think if you keep shooting the coin, you get like more points or something. Get away. Oh, so you gotta save this guy. Come here, birds. And I think I just got a bunch of gift subs. I saw that. When whenever somebody gives me a bunch of gift subs, the it like lights up. So like I see that for sure. And oh, those are also from uh, D Three Gun. Thank you very much. So he gives the subs to the Global Baker, uh, Crap, Boomstick, Devastator, EX, and DJ Hess. If you got a gift sub from D Three Gun, let him know you appreciate it. I do very much. Once again, thank you very much. And by the way, he has gifted three hundred and 19 subs on this channel. So that is a lot, so thank you very much for that. You've been doing that for a long time and I appreciate it. That's a lot, and for a long time, I know. Thank you, seriously. You're keeping, you're keeping, keeping my channel going here, thank you, appreciate it. Typing of the Dead on Dreamcast. That's another one. Uh, King Boomer says Metroid Dread was hard as shit and great game as well. Okay, well, I mean, I'm doing Wii right now, but uh, Metroid Dread is another discussion for another day. <laughs> I keep hitting the wrong thing. I'm supposed to hit one to skip this stuff. A security god? Oh, oh, by the way, the weak point's his head. You wouldn't guess that ever, right? Who would ever figure his his head would be the weak point? Re 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 reload, reload. I know there's, there's some barrels over here if I can get them, if there's anything in them. Hey, we're just passing through. We're just passing through. Get out of here. Fuck them. I love that you have like this shotgun too. It's perfect. This is a great, uh, you call it a light gun game? Or a rail shooter. Oh, that was a little health thing right there. I think I saw that. Sweet, sweet, sweet. G, above you. G. G. Certainly is persistent. Reload, reload. What else do we got? Can we shoot the cars or something? Got him. I'm just shooting the shit around the sides to see if I can get anything else. G. All right. Do 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 do. They didn't let me put my name in. Yeah. You all right, Lisa? Genwa says, Mike, it's 8:20 in the UK. Watching you on the way to work. 
There, were, there was a guy once watching my stream. You probably already know what I'm going to say. He, uh, he was jerking off with Lemon Pledge watching my stream. But he wasn't on the way to work. He was just driving, I think, in the middle of the night. And then the car just off the side of the cliff exploded into 100 million pieces. That's what happens when you jerk off with Lemon Pledge. While you're, I like to think he had he he was holding the the cell phone like this, and they didn't even like it. Tried, maybe trying to drive with his knee a little bit. <laughs> it's like Wiley e. Coyote going off the cliff. Speaking of Wiley e. Coyote, um, if you guys haven't seen the new Looney Tunes cartoons, I've mentioned this a couple times now, but it's just I. Oh, the reason I keep mentioning it is that's something I always wanted to happen for them to like animate new Looney Tunes cartoons in the style, in the like the good style when it was like the 1940s and the 1950s when the Looney Tunes cartoons were good, you know. And that's exactly what they've done. So I feel like that's something I have to shout out a couple times because I'm like, I watched a bunch of them and they're really good and they like they did it the right way and that's something that I always wanted to see happen. So there you go. Everybody yells at me because I always say like, oh, nothing's good anymore and I only like old things and whatever. But the animators who who did that show are doing a great job and I hope they continue with that. And that's, that's new, but I mean, based on something old, but... It's good for like a remake type of thing. I mean, there, there you go. That's another remake uh, or uh, reimagining, whatever you want to call it. But I mentioned Wiley e. Coyote because there are new like uh, Roadrunner cartoons as part of that. But it's it's all of the stuff. It's like Daffy Duck cartoons and Bugs Bunny. Uh, all the all the characters. Porky Pig gets cartoons. The whole thing. So it's really uh, definitely definitely worth checking out. That that's on uh, HBO Max. Now, what I'm not the biggest fan of is how there's so many different damn services you have to have now to watch everything that you want to watch. But that's the way it is. That's the way it is, man. I did see the new Elvis movie, by the way. And um, I can talk about that if you want to hear my opinions, but. Let me pause real quick because I just saw that more gift subs came in. And first of all, uh, the Derbs, thank you very much for gifting a tier one sub to Sticky Merlin. I appreciate that. Sticky, good old Sticky Merlin. Um, <laughs> thank you, the Derbs. And then D3 Gun gifted out a bunch more gift subs. So you guys, listen up. Moonwatcher V3, Get Down Arnie, Hino PO, uh, Sharkkin, Mord Fustang. Shane's birthday tweet, Blaze Inferno 360, Devil Man, Coffee Pie, and Mega Gak all got gift subs from D3 Gun. So now he's up to 329. He's just he's just like he this is this is D3 Gun. He's like he's like, "Oh, you want you want to see some shit? Look like, look at this. Look what I can do." Yeah? You think I'm done? I ain't done. Look at this. <laughs> he's just he's waving his giant dick around tonight. He's like, "Yeah." Oh yeah, look at this, check it out. <laughs> um, oh yeah, but the Elvis movie. Uh, so the Elvis movie was like, is alright, I don't know. It's There's some things in it that are factually really incorrect. Like, So I'm going to say just one thing about it. There's a part in the movie where they have Elvis on stage and he is, he calls out Colonel Parker um... You know, for, he's like he's like oh, he's an alien man and, and all that. None of that ever happened. They like made that up for the movie, and there's a few other things that are like made up in the movie. So it's not all uh, some of some of that shit's made up. You know, so it's not all real. And then uh, Tom Hanks. So here's the deal. So Colonel Parker did not have an accent like that. You can go on YouTube right now and watch an interview with Colonel Tom Parker, who was, who was Elvis's manager, if you don't know anything about it. And Tom Hanks plays him in the movie. 
Um, I don't know why they made the decision to give him that ac the accent. So he, because he was trying to like get away with it, you know. So his accent, he he just sounded, you know, he di he didn't have an accent. So. I don't know why they did that, and it, 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 and it made the hit like Tom Hanks's like uh, character seem very cartoonish, you know. And he kept being like, you know, trying to get Elvis to wear like Christmas sweaters and stuff, and it's like, yeah. You know, so he did like the '68 comeback special, and they they make it out to be like, oh, all Colonel Tom Parker t cared about was like Elvis. Doing the Christmas special, so it keeps going like, uh, "Is it Christmas? Is it Christmas?" Like it was just like, I don't know. That said, uh, the strong points of the movie, though, they got the whoever did like the look, the like the styles and the the backgrounds and the costuming and all that. Like it all looked really, really nice. And when they have when they show like the International Hotel. And like the way things looked was good. They mention a lot of Elvis band members and whatever, but they, they also leave out a lot, which is a little weird too. Like they'll mention certain certain people, and then there's certain people that they totally ignore. Like they they don't talk about his like later girlfriends and stuff. And I don't know. It's it's sort of a mixed bag that movie. Uh, I did. I did think the guy who played Elvis. I forget the actor's name, but uh, I think he did a pretty good job uh, for the most part. So it, it's. I don't know. What what I would recommend the most is like go watch some. Re if if you want to like know about Elvis, go watch some, some real Elvis material. <laughs> You know, as opposed to you know, if that's your introduction to Elvis, I don't think it should be. Like, just go watch some real Elvis stuff. You'd be better off. But that said, I don't think I don't think it was horrible or anything. It was fine. So that, there you go. That's my review of that movie. It was like, it was fine, I guess. I don't know. That's, that's as much as I can say about it. I know people, because I'm an Elvis fan, I know people wanted to know my opinion on it. It's fine. I don't know. I didn't, I didn't hate it. I didn't love it. I was glad I saw it once, but I probably won't watch it again. That's about it. Look at this. Is this a giant sloth? You like how I'm doing this while I'm, I'm giving my Elvis movie review while I'm playing House of the Dead 3. That's pretty on brand, I'd say. Come on, are you gonna move? Reload. Fuck. Fucker. You motherfucker. Damn it! I can't seem to get that. Last one. Did I, did I get it that time? I think that time I got it. What? Fuck! There we go. I think I got it that time. Jeez. You cannot miss a shot on that. God. Uh, thank you, Nevada1111, for the sub. Did they keep the part in the movie where Forrest Gump shows Elvis how to dance? Right. And thank you, the Derb, for gifting a sub to Dawn Wanderer. Speaking of Elvis movies, have you ever seen the real Elvis's 1956 to 1969 movie output? Um, Maybe someone's trying to continue his legacy. Why do you say 1969? Because his best movies he did in 1970 and 1972. So there's there's movies after 1969. You're talking about his acting career. Morality. Yeah, I've seen most of it. It's not a. Uh, 
That's not what I meant to. You're getting along with them. So you want to watch Elvis stuff, as far as watching stuff, I mean there's plenty to listen to, but you want, um, you pretty you want the, you want the sun sessions, you want to watch Elvis, that's the way it is, you want to watch Elvis on tour, you want to watch Aloha from Hawaii, you want to watch the 68 comeback special, um, Beyond that, uh, it's mostly listening material. There's probably some things I'm forgetting. Yeah, but the acting stuff, I'm I'm not a big fan of, for the most part. Some of it's a, there's a, there's some things here and there that are okay, but not a big fan of the acting stuff. And that's it. So ends my review. of... Elvis movie. Boom. Oh, I was hoping that would blow up and take care of all these shit. Want shoot that coin. I think I'm just getting like extra points for that coin, right? I don't know. All right, I gotta save this asshole. I saved you. Look at these gross stairs. You're dead. This game controls like really, really well. But what the hell is that thing? And thank you for that raid, uh, Sean Owl. Appreciate it. Oh my god, and we got more. He's just waving her around. Um, <laughs> D3 Gun gifted out more subs to Scar, Slash Revolver, Cool Spot, Tyler, and Original Zero. You guys all got gift subs from D3 Gun. Thank you again. All right, let's check this out. We got a boss fight. Hang on. Is that like, that's completely a game over? Fuck. Or can you continue? Can you continue? Oh shit, I think it's all the way back at the beginning. Wow, that's hard. Shit, that boss looked cool too with the, like the faces on the thing. All right, well, I, th I guess that's it for House of the Dead. Oh, oh, look at that though. You can now increase life to four. So it's one of those, like, Gradius 5. If you keep playing over and over, they give you more continues. No wonder, I say. So it's like, ah, keep going, though. Keep going. All right. Um, so that's cool. That's House of the Dead 3. I'm going to pop on another game, though, because we're going to be playing some different stuff. But that's cool. All right. So here you have Big Fuck Hunter. And we're going we're gonna to do some big fucking here. One track. The Final Frontier. <laughs> Let's go hunt. What about Purr Pals? I streamed Purr Pals and all those pet games a long time ago. We did some shovelware oh, a year ago or something, or six months ago or something, I don't know. Shoot the fucks! Right, here we go. I got two. I don't think I got the third. One, two, double fuck you. All right. One, two. Is the controller effective? For this game, it is. Um, some games, the controller works, the Wiimote works really well. And some games, it does not. Depends what game you're playing. 
And I think that's one of the problems that we had is that some games it works awesome, and other games not so much. And I got one. Got two. So you try to get all three for the for the gold and getting silver, I guess. At least I'm shooting something. Try this one, see if I can get the gold on any of these. I wonder if you can redo them. Did I get did I get that? I think I got that. Oh Yee-hoo! One, two, three! Triple fuck! There you go. You really fucking nail that one, let me tell you. <laughs> now really though, I wonder if I can uh, redo the ones that I didn't get all three on. I don't know if you can redo them. I feel like you have to do the whole area over. Let's see, can I do it? Can I? No, you can't. You have to go on to the others. Thank you, Alcoholic Rob, for the sub. Fuck. Oh, oh, I, oh no, I shot the wrong one. If you shoot the, you have to shoot the ones with the antlers. So I totally fucked that one up. God damn it. There you go. At least we finished it out decently. <laughs> Yeah, hey. get her done. Never again. Didn't he play the Tooth Fairy? Did you guys ever see that movie? Oh my god, we have Duck Hunt now? Okay. I'll try. I think I got every single one. Well, look at me. So if you're just joining, we're playing uh, Big Fuck Hunter Pro for the Nintendo Wii. Let's keep going. Yep, let's keep hunting. <laughs> and we'll be playing some more games later. I got a, a list of a few games, and I'll take some suggestions if anybody knows any good games. Good start. Can I get perfect for everything? That'd be awesome. Lots of mighty fine shooting. All right. You gotta have the hunting babes too. Motherfuck! It ends it if you shoot one of those. Yeah. Uh, double fuck. Great. There goes my streak. Well, it wasn't much of a streak because I only got through the one. <laughs> Target terror. Uh, actually, you know what? I had that written down as one of the ones I want to try. I guess. That's a big old one. Yeah, you're the new hunter hero. But yeah, Megastar, um Oh, I'm gonna try that one too. Oops. 
barely got that. Ooh. Ooh. Fuck! Come on. It's not easy. Arcade game, yeah. I think this comes from an arcade, I believe, right? Actually, I want to see a machine of that. Big fuck hunter pro. Let's see what comes up. Oh my god, that's not, not what I thought was gonna come up. Oh, wait, hang on, fuck, hang on. the game's going here. Hang on, god damn it. I didn't realize the fucking game was going. I was trying to look at this. Yeah, wow, it's been a long time since I've seen one of those. Yeah, the, yeah. so it's a, it was an arcade game with the, you know, you pull out the rifle or whatever. All right, so now we're in the snow. And thank you very much, J-Balls, for gifting us up the toss and a coin to Twitch. Thank you. Thank you, J-Balls. One more. Nice. And then it's like you can also get the other animals for like probably bonus points, but it's like, it's tough. All right, so that's one. And also like how good your accuracy is and Motherfuck! You had to run into the fucking way? You dumb shit! I'm trying to be the. No, zero. Well, there you go, there's the worst. Done. I think I got it. Motherfucker getting in the way! I hate the other ones that get in the way. <sighs> oh, this will make me go fucking nuts. We, uh, oh. Where's the other motherfucker? I got two. This is not hard. The chat is like laughing at me. What? He's getting upset at video games. <laughs> you never got upset at a video game? The fuck is that? A fucking anteater? You can tell I'm a real animal expert here. It's a shame the Super Nintendo Bazooka didn't get some cool games. You mean the Super Scope? And there are some cool games, actually, with it. One of these days we'll do a Super Scope stream. Or maybe I'll do that with Aaron. Is that this fucking cow shit? There, I, there's a person I know who would really enjoy this. There's a 
person I, I know who has a thing about uh, shit. I don't, I don't know if you knew. <laughs> I know somebody who, who who would very much appreciate that. Execation, thank you very much for this tier one sub. It's like, it's also, it's like, you know, it's bullshit with the cow. <laughs> My god. Uh, so, what do we got here? Let's do, I want to. How about this one? And do a little bit more and then we'll move on to another game. This is fun though, I like this one. That other one that I played the other day. Uh, there, there's a lot of hunting games on the Wii, but this one's actually pretty fun. Some of the other ones are like, I don't know. I don't mind this one. Oh, I, I which do I, I guess I get those? Shit, I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay, so I gotta get that. Not that, this. I think. Was that the last one? Yeah, so the ram, double ram. Ram it in your ass. I, say, I try to get to the jokes before the chat does. Try to beat you, beat you guys to the punch. Sorry. Would you rather me leave it to you? Are you upset when I do that? They're like, hey, we were going to do that. That's our job. Let us do something. You get to play the games. No toadstool. Oh my god. What, what am I gonna do with you? <laughs> you drive me insane. There was. Oh my god. How about the guy? There's a guy who comes comes in. I haven't seen him in a while. But he comes in and once in a while and he goes, "Hey, it's for horses." And this is the other one. No, no toadstool. Stool. And then there's another guy who goes, Mega Man. And then I got another guy who comes in and he just says random names from Star Trek things. Just anything. And he'll just come in. And he comes in for like five minutes into my streams and he go, he'll go like, uh, Loxwana Troy. And I'll go, oh yeah, yeah, she was on Star Trek The Next Generation. And then, and then he'll go, uh, uh, Baylock Puppet. I'm like, yeah, it was on the original series. Corb Corbin, Corbin might maneuver. I know. I know that episode. And then he's gone. Oh, shit. Fuck. You killed a new. A new. Hey, Mike, dilithium. Yeah, exactly. Be doing sub, and he says, Buck you, Mike. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. At least I didn't get zero on any. Didn't speak too soon, I guess. Fucking asshole. At least I got two. Do, 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 Holy beans, I love this game at the local pizza shop, or at least one of those similar games. Had a friend, little sister, scream. You took down the whole screen of bucks and dough. Because <laughs> she, she felt bad. Oh, we got, we're gonna kill the doves. Here we go. Fuck them. Hey, this is great. Oh, can I also get the... I thought I could take out the butterfly. Did she like when you were shooting all the butterfly? She was like, hey, don't shoot all the butterfly. You're like, oh, no, I'm gonna bl blow the butterfly out of the fucking sky. Wait until you see. There ain't gonna be no butterflies left in this county. Yee-hoo! Is that, is that how that went? Oh my god, thank you very much, D3Gun, for gifting out more subs to the community. He's You're getting up there. The 339 now. Nintendo Fingers, 
420 Bob, Legacy of Torment, uh, Chill84, and Rue Devil. Let's keep going. You guys all got subs. Uh, okay, that's enough. We're going to move on to another game. So that's uh, Big Buck Hunter Pro. Fun game. I'm not really a guy that's usually for into the um, hunting games and stuff. Like, I don't usually play a lot of those, but that's a pretty fun one. All right, so this game is like full motion video. Think Sega CD, that era. Um, it's sort of a technique they would use to save money. They'd film somebody in a day or two, film people, and then instead of having to have, pay an artist to do sprites, they would film somebody and then like throw the video into the game somehow. I think it's a cost-saving measure. And uh, it makes the games kind of um, funny because of it. Terrorists have seized the baggage claim. Let's go for the action right now. Stand by connecting live feed. Oh, you mean it's a live stream? Oh, that's right. I gotta go. Hey, wait. I gotta go off the side of the screen or something. To, sorry, I'm figuring out the controls. There we go. So you go down. There it is. Got another a machine gun now. And I know while it's funny because it's like full motion video and it like it looks crappy, it's the gameplay is not that bad. Like you would think, you know, that it's oh I shouldn't don't do that. Uh, shoot the shoot the phone shoot the phone like it's it's still fun even though it, like it looks stupid and it's like cheap back there in the fire. Checkpoint, checkpoint. They tried to be futuristic. So you can do, oh, you can do like that. Okay. That's cool. Isn't it funny, the guy hanging off? It's funny to think, oh crap. I'm like not looking at who I'm shooting here. Where are all these actors? And how many of these actors are the same guy in different costumes? Like all of them? They, what, they, they probably had like three different people. And it's just everybody's in a different outfit, right? I mean, probably, don't you think? I wonder how many people they actually got to do this. Probably not a lot. Oh, okay, you're... Don't shoot him. Fuck! Yeah. 
Yeah, I mean, like I said, like it's still fun though. I wonder if there's any like boss type of things, or if it's all just like this. Oh, do, don't shoot them. Give me that. I got an extra life, which I need because I'm not doing well. Remember like a uh, Mad Dog McCree and all that kind of stuff. I shoot him in fucking balls? Seriously. What is going on here? Whoa. Oh, I got a freeze gun! Look at this. Now we're going like science fiction. Yeah, freeze! Okay, so this is just like, it's just absolutely ridiculous. Oh, sorry, buddy. D damn it. I didn't mean to kill your full motion video form, but I did. I'm an asshole. You guys got a chainsaw. Secured. Scene one cleared. All right, so that's like the whole first level, huh? Got some golds, huh? I mean, I guess I could have done worse. I don't hate this game. I think it's fine. How well did I do? Not, <laughs> not good at all. I was in eighth. All right, well, I did really bad, but I, I, I but I had fun. Oh, wait a second, wait. It just put me in first place. Oh, they tallied them all up. Wait a second, I was first place. Never mind. All right, uh, should we do one more? Let's do Golden Gate. Raw news. Let's go live right now. What rail shooter is this? This is Target Terror. For the Wii. Shit, I keep doing that. I always forget that there's gonna be people that you gotta save like that. So yeah, oh damn. Yeah, target terror for the Wii. Fuck. It's, it's, it's not easy. Cause you look at it and you're like, oh, this game's a joke. Huh, but, I mean, sure, it looks stupid, but. It's not, it's, you, you like seriously can shoot these guys in their fucking balls. Oh, I tried try to get that item. I, I will shoot your fucking balls off, like literally. What more do you want? I think that should be something that's in more video games. Ah, fuck you, was that Mary Poppins or some shit? More games, you need to be able to shoot people in their fucking balls. Oh, rocket launcher! Okay, that's awesome. I wish it would have lasted longer. Oh, take a rocket launcher to the fucking balls. That's what video games need. You don't, you don't see that enough, in my opinion. Like you could take, I mean, you could just blow away anybody's balls, blow their balls off. You ever hear that expression, oh, I'll blow your balls off. Well, if you blow your balls off, like wouldn't your cock get blown off too? Does anybody just get their balls blown off? And how, how does that happen exactly? To where just your balls get blown off? 
All right, there. I actually. Oh damn it! Uh, there's a Rubik's cube. Okay. I, I, all right. I didn't know there was gonna be two good people. They threw me for a loop there. Fuck you, motherfucker! Blow your balls off and your dick too. Ha ah. ha! All right. I, I won't. I won't shoot you. I'm trying to not shoot those people. That's the guy you shoot as well. There's like one guy who does like an animation for that. Oh no, that guy too, actually. Never mind. There's more than one blow the balls off people. How do you like this commentary? There's more than one blow the balls off people. Like, and then you can like freeze their balls. I like totally froze his balls off. Oh yeah! Eat my shit! I don't know. I like this game. I'm not. You know what? I I, I gotta tell you guys something. I'm. I was never really a big full motion video person. I never had a lot of interest in it, and I never really. I don't, I don't like really often find it that funny. It's like, I get it, they film the guy and it looks kind of crappy. Like, it was never really my thing. Like the, you know, like the, the, all that stuff. But I tell you what though, combine it with good gameplay though, because this is actually fun. So I don't know, I like this. I do like this. I, ha I, I have to honestly admit, I legitimately like this game. And look at me, number one, baby, number one. All right, here's a game that nobody talks about. I've never heard anybody mention it ever. Uh, but I want to show this to you. So this is going to start. Yeah, I'm going to start a new game here. So let's see. Uh, civilization level, start there. Money and goods. That's... Fine, let's start that. Um, so, how do I explain this? I don't even know how I explain this. Um, so, hey, let me zoom out a little bit for one thing. Oh, here's the island, okay. So we're gonna, here's my ship. We're gonna sail this guy out to here. Let me zoom in. All right, so, basically, think of like uh, SimCity, or like Warcraft, you know that kind of thing. Not so much the battles, or like Age of Empires, that kind of that kind of thing. So it's like I land here, right? And I can like I can build if it lets me build. I can build a road, right? So I'm gonna build a road. All right. So I built a road there, and then let me build another road. And we're gonna build a road from here. If it let me, let me do it. So you build a road from here out to here, right? So it's like that kind of thing. So what do I need? I need some houses, right? So I'm gonna put that, put down some houses, just like Sim City, that type of thing. You're trying to build up your population. But what else? What else would you need? You might need a way to eat or have food, right? Um, and there's probably different things you can do to do that. They're going to need a marketplace, for sure. So let's build a marketplace. And apply. I like how this stuff just like plops down. Um, and then that's another boat you can do. Uh, building materials. Uh, lumberjack. So the lumberjack can, you know, get you some world. Get you some world? You can, <laughs> I'm so sorry. You can, you can zoom in. And then I'm gonna make sure that I have a road going out to this, so I just wanna make sure that's definitely connected there. There, all right, so there's a road connected to that. And then what else can we do? So we have goods. So the food, I think you can build a fisherman's hut, so I'm gonna put the fisherman's hut there. And then I'm gonna build a road out to that. So road goes from here to here, and that's my fisherman's hut, right? Okay. Then what else can you do? You can do, uh, you can, that's like a dairy thing that you can do later as you like upgrade. I can build a chapel. He saw me crying in the chapel. Do, 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 with tears of joy. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Um, so 
what else can I do right now? I can't do any more of that. I, I can't do that. I can't do that. I'm just going to put houses down. He saw me crying in the chapel. The tears you felt were tears of joy. I think that's how it goes. You saw the meaning of contentment. Do, 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 do. Um, all right, so you can like actually even watch the people. Like he's gonna take this out to the warehouse. Um, and so yeah, as this goes, you're gradually getting like more materials and all that stuff. Um, all that, all that good stuff. And I can build a shipyard, I think. You ever have the feeling like you're gonna sneeze? Like I feel like that right now. Like I'm, I might sneeze like really bad. So if there's a big sneeze in a moment, I'm, I'm letting you know it might be coming. <laughs> uh, so where is the shipyard thing? Uh, here's another food. I can't do any of that yet. Where is the shipyard? How do you do it? That's just a regular house. Building materials. Wouldn't it be like an advanced structure or something? Maybe I can't do it yet. You can do this sh shit eventually. I might not be able to build it yet. Got the lumberjack's hut. The quarry. Uh, I don't know if I can build one here. Oh, maybe here, actually. Can I build one there? Let's see if I can do this. So, uh, oh, God damn it. Which one was it under? So it's letting me do that. So here, I can put that there. Or so I thought. Well, let me... Put that down. Put that shit down. There, I put it down. But we we would need a road that would go out there. Let's have the road go like that. I mean, that's like really far away from everything, but I don't know. Uh, in fact, since that is so goddamn far away, let's hear it. Let's put some houses out here, and maybe some. Uh, Special buildings. How about, how about another marketplace? Let's get a marketplace here. I just want them to start using this damn thing. I don't exactly know how you get this going yet. So I just, I'm like new to this game. But I like this kind of stuff, this like town building stuff. I've always been a fan of these kind of games. Uh, so I'm going to put more and more and more houses down. Because the more houses I down, put down, the more people will join and... All that good stuff. Let's put some more out here. Here's another house. And here's another house. Alright, so let's see if I can build anything else yet. I don't know. Uh, so, we need more settlers for that. Uh, I don't think I can do any of that yet. So, goods, building materials, house. Damn it. Um... There's a little bit of, like, waiting involved. So, stone mason. Jeez, where can you put that? Can I put that, like... What if I put it, like, right here? Let's see if it lets me. Put... There, I put one there. I don't know if... Here, let's see what it says. I don't think I've built one of these before. Oh, it needs to be near the quarry. Okay, let's get rid of that. I fucked up then. Here, wait. So watch, watch how you destroy a building. This is funny. <laughs> Gets rid of it like that. So I, it would need to be there. So let's see if I can do that again. Um, so like that. So what if I did it like... What if I put him like there? Maybe that'll work. But we need a, we need a road out to it. That's for sure. So maybe that'll connect that and work. I hope... And what else could we possibly do? Can we do a... Um, I'm kind of getting ahead of myself with all this stone stuff. I, I can't do like any of that yet. So how's this lumberjack thing going? Is, is he actually producing some damn wood for me? I, I think I think he is. I, you know what I'm going to do, actually? I'm going to make another lumberjack. Let's make a couple of those. because Oh, look at all this woods out here. I'm going to use this area for lumberjack lumberjacking you, you guys I know the people in my chat they're real big fans of uh, lumberjacking they, they love that so if you are if you are <laughs> if you're a real 
fan of jacking. Uh, so wait, I can build a dairy thing too. Here, let's put this right there. There's one dairy thing, and honestly, like, I could probably use another one of those too. Let's do another dairy over here. Boom. Okay, so now what I want to do is I want to put down a lumberjack. Let's do another one. So I'm going to put one right there. So we got all these lumberjacks going. This I can build shit too. Um, so quar quar quarry. I can't say that word. I'm very sorry. Um, so 20 settlers. Still can't, huh? Damn it. I'm waiting for all this shit to upgrade. It takes a little bit of time. I don't know if you can speed the game up. I'm guessing that that's, you know, a thing that can happen, but... So I'm saying, is anybody going out here and using this? How's this fisherman side going? So the fisherman is bringing the fish in. See, some fish just happened, and then... I don't know if anybody goes to pick the fish up or anything. And then how about the marketplace? Like, what's going on with that? So it's like it's like a one-star marketplace. Oh, you know what? I just remembered. So you can also do a barracks. Uh, so the barracks... Can I make that yet? Yeah, I might not be able to yet. You gotta, like, wait on some of these things. Um, I, don't, I don't... I can't do it quite yet, I don't think. So we gotta wait on that. 200 settlers you need for that. You know what I need? I'm, I'm gonna start... Now I'm going to start putting down, like, a ton of houses. That's what I'm going to do. I haven't mastered these controls yet, so... There's probably a quicker way to do this than how I'm doing it. Oh, what I'm doing is I'm hitting, like, B, and then B, and then A, and I feel like I'm able to do it really quickly. It's like, oh, you hit B on top of... Okay, I know how to do it now. So you hit B on top of a thing that you want to, like, rebuild and build another one of. That's how you do it. So, wait, wait, get off of that. So that, and then that. So look at all these now I'm building. Because if they don't have the houses, I guess they can't... I guess we can't make this place a big enough place. Uh, okay, so that's a lot of motherfuckers... So now I'm going to have another road going out. We're going to have another road going like this, and this road's going to go like that. You have reached the next shitty level. The shitty level. Okay, so now we can trade. Yeah, new technology from the tech tree. I mean, i got to go through all this to be able to do everything. Establish trade con uh, contract, yes. So that's good. Um, I'm only going to play so much of this, but I just wanted to like show you guys this and that if you like these kind of games, like you might be interested. Not everybody likes these kind of games, and I understand that. Um, but I usually like this kind of stuff. So if you like SimCity um, and you happen to still own a Wii, that's what I was wondering about with this like video. It's like how many people still even have a Wii? Uh, to even care about doing this kind of thing anymore. Like, will, th will this video even help anybody anyway? Because, like, do you, do you guys even have a Wii anymore? That's another comment you can leave me. Like, do you even have a goddamn Wii? Maybe some of you guys do, because I know some of you guys that watch me are, like, retro gamers. Oh, here's a fire station. So these places can, like, go on fire, so I got to put some fire stations down before I have a problem. I don't have enough gold or materials, so that's not good. So I guess I gotta wait. I might be waiting on wood. What am I waiting on? How much wood do we have? I'm probably waiting on wood, so I probably should be putting down another, um... Well, you've unlocked the guest house! I, I, here, here comes the wood, so now I have nine wood. So how um, many would I need to build another fire station there I was able to put one down so it cost a couple of wood so you know what I'm gonna do since wood is starting to become a problem let's build another lumberjack hut I'm gonna build one out here hopefully we get that wood coming in a little faster um, 
So let's see what else we can put down. We'd be able to see what I want to do is I want to do the barracks. I have to wait for ten. I need ten wood in order to do the barracks. This is where I just sit and wait and I'll just talk to you guys. No, I really wonder if there's a way to speed it up. There probably is. What if I have one? A one brings that up, what's two do? Options. Maybe I can is there game speed? Few hints. Enough hints. I don't know if there's a game speed thing. I think this game is... Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want to just get off of that. I think this game is also on, like, Steam and PC and stuff, so if you'd rather play this with a keyboard and mouse, it's just interesting that a game like this is on Wii, and you can, like, play it with this, and it works fairly well, you know, so you drag around with A, you know. So let's put down a barracks, because that would, that would be good to have. To protect protect my people right um, and then what else can we do you can do we can do a school if I can not totally move the Wiimote wrong I mean you got to get used to it all right we're dropping that down so, so we got a school now and what else can we do? You can do a guest house. But I, eventually you get, like, attacked and all that. But, they, you know, they give you time to do all this shit. So if I click on the guest house, I guess it's just a place. It's like a restaurant, right, I guess, I would assume, that they can all go eat. That's great. You'll find That's where you'll find me, by the way. I'll be, I'll be in there having some salmon or whatever. Um, uh... We can build a shipyard also. Shipyard is definitely something that you want. Because then you can build out another ship and go to another island. And that's something that I should show you guys. So as this builds, I'm going to click this and try to start building one uh, exploration ship. That's what I want. Th that's going to gradually build a ship there. Uh, also, by the way, you can zoom in and out. So if you want to zoom in and out, it's the plus and minus. If, if you are playing the Wii version of this, so that's minus all the way, and then you zoom in, so let's say I want to zoom in, uh, whatever, over here, you can zoom in with plus, so that's how you do that, and then you can drag it around to see what these guys are doing. You can actually, like, watch the people go around, if, if you're so inclined, like, what are these people up to? Oh, look, it's a fox, and they're standing around jerking off, or whatever they're doing, you know? What if I, what if I just, like, look out here, and I, like, go out here, and there's just like a guy standing behind here. He's like jerking off. <laughs> like, <laughs> just program that into the game. Oh my god. Um, uh, that's why I like this game. It's that Wii game with the guy jerking off in the background. And I think it's uh, more more games should be like this. Uh, uh, what else? So there's like other stuff that unlocks. Oh, the, so the ship is unlocked. Um, so here's the ship. So you click on it, and then here we go. Do 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 And I'm zooming in more. Do 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 And you can go to another island somewhere. We'll find another one. If they put another one on the map, I'm assuming there's one somewhere. What if there's only one? There's got to be more than one. Well, last time I played this, there was more than one island. Are they only putting one island on this map? Maybe they did. Really? Okay, well, I have to tell you a lot. That's weird. Last time I played this, there was another island that you can go to. I don't know if more of this, like, Fog of War map, like, unlocks later, but... Usually you can go to another island. I don't know why I can't right now. Maybe I, my town might need to upgrade more, and then maybe they'll let me go further out. I'm not. I'm not sure. But um, let's see what else we can do. So, like I said, we have barracks. So I built that. I built fire station. You know what? Having another fire station is always good. And put down another fire station. I'm always worried like these fires will happen. It's funny when it happens. Like little guys run with buckets. They run out when there's a fire and they have to put them out. Oh, there is. Uh, there's like a crop production thing. What is it? This. The gardens. 
So we need more gardens, so I'm gonna do that. There we go. I'm gonna put a garden out there. And can I put a garden out here somewhere? Maybe out here I'd be able to in this area. I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put another garden like here. There, so we got a couple gardens going now, so that's growing. Now what's this? Clay. I don't know, is that part of this? I don't know, they want more like clay. Settlers and heavens with the higher civilization enjoy the herbs from this garden. Okay, so, oh, there you go, did you see it? Here, here's the guy running with the buckets. They, there he goes, and he's going back to the firehouse because there was a place on fire. So see, I was glad that I made it to the firehouse. I was ready, I was ready for that. Um, what else, Did they, are they doing anything with this? I feel like that nothing's happening with any of this. What, what is, what happened to this place? This place just got fucked up or what? Oh, I just saw somebody go in there. So I guess he is working, okay. So I got that actually doing something. So how about this, can I do this yet? Here, let me zoom this out a little bit. I haven't quite figured out this part of it yet. Like I said, I am I'm new to this. Uh, so, but it just, you know, it's the kind of game that I feel like I could sit and fuck with for a very long time. So it's an ore smelter. Let me put that, I don't know like where that really needs to be, but let's put it here. It's near, it's near this mountain. So I mean, maybe that's okay for it to be there. Let's see what it says. It says, it says, it says, It says, oh, so it has to connect to a warehouse and a marketplace. Okay, so is this a warehouse? That's a stonemason. So for one thing, I can fix that. I can fix the road problem really easily. And then as far as the warehouse, oh, the thing went away, I guess because the guy can like walk out to it. I don't know. I'm going to fix the make this road better because I could connect it. Oh, I can't connect it through. Can I? Oh, wait. Yeah. Can I get it to go like that? No, you can't. Damn. This is not really a good place for this, is it? Damn it. Well, whatever. They can walk. I guess you can walk, assholes. <laughs> He's got a long walk to go, I guess. Um, and then how about the ore mine? You know what? Maybe I can put it out here. How about that? There you go. Now let's get a road out to that shit. And connect it. And how about some more, uh, where, I don't know what, like, where exactly they'd be, like, taking that. So is this good? I mean, I think it's, it's connected. There's no thing above it. So hopefully that's gonna start working. I don't know. Nothing else is unlocking. I'm gonna put a couple houses out here, like, I want. Some shit going on. And then they're talking about it like a warehouse. So the smelter, lumberjack, quarry, stonemason. I think I built all of that. So what else can we do? Um, I built one of those. I don't have 200 settlers, so I can't do that yet. Uh, I'm, I'm going to build another dairy place, maybe. Why not? Here. Have another. Have some more dairy. Sure. And... So I'm like kind of just waiting at this point. So I'm gonna put down more houses, I think, because I need more people. Seems to be the problem. How many settlers do I have right now? I have 355 inhabitants. They have to be settlers. See, that's the problem. You gotta like upgrade these people, and I'm not. I'm not doing well. Oh, there you go. I clicked upgrade on that. Oh, I'm not like upgrading the buildings. Shit, maybe that's my problem. What is going on with this? This is like full or something, right? Can I upgrade that? I don't know if you can upgrade that. Stop production. Don't want to do that. So some of the buildings you can upgrade. Wait, let me find, where's that other? So some of them you can click on and upgrade, but some of them you can't, I guess. And what's wrong with this? 
this ore is melted, it produces iron, but it needs ore from a nearby ore mine to do so. Okay, so well, hopefully, hopefully these people are bringing this out here. You know what? I feel like this is a bad setup. Here, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna destroy this. Okay, and I'm gonna put the, I'm gonna put one of those like right next to it. Let's do. It was uh. It was the smelter, right? So let's put that, let's put it there. Maybe that'll work better. So let's see what's going on here. So he, he walked out of there and he went into the marketplace, I think. So he's running back with, what's he running back with? Beef or something? Hot dogs? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I got the guy. So the guy that works at the smelting place is like, I'm going to go get some hot dogs from the market and fuck, fuck this job. Oh, he went in there. He just went in. Wait, wait. I'm watching. Is he going to start smelting shit? Our people are starving. Fuck. All right. Hang on. Wait. Let's look at the food problem here. Well, I got the dairy shit going. How about more food? Oh, here's a grain farm. There. There's a grain farm. Let me uh, put some more of these grain farms in. I'm going to put one over here. Our people are starving. Like, I didn't even realize. I'm so sorry. I feel bad now. Here, you're going to get grain farm, right? Uh, if I can put one somewhere. Here, here. you know what's going to happen? Here. Demolish. Demolish. Now you're going to get grain. Farm. I just, like, destroyed their houses. We need more food. I know. Well, that's why I just built that. So hopefully that helps. And I'm gonna put, can I put another one here or something? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna bring this out like this and then like that. And then that to that here. So I'm gonna put another one down. This is gonna be food again. We're gonna have more, here's more bread. You guys are gonna have plenty of bread now. I think if I did this right, so let's check out one of these other ones that I made. Like here, this place is going. So I'm gonna click this. Can I upgrade this? Maybe I can later. What's the problem with this? It needs ore from a nearby ore mine to do so. Isn't that this shit? I don't know. I'm a little confused on this part. Look at all these people and they're all unhappy. So I'm doing Terrible. I'm doing terribly. And they're all starving. I made so much bread. Maybe, you know what? It probably takes a long time for these bread places to get, to get moving and grooving, huh? I should have built that earlier. Can, is there anything I can do to save the day here? I need to build that. I want that. You need to get citizens to unlock this option. Yeah, I, exactly. Yeah, I need that. I agree with you. I'm putting down more bread stuff. Make the fucking bread. Look at the look at the population going down. Is everybody dying? Oh my god. So I just murdered everyone. All right, I need to listen. I need to learn how to play the game better, clearly, but I enjoy it. And uh, if you're an expert on this game, drop me some tips. So my 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 problem is that um, I don't know how to connect to these damn th this shit. And I guess I had to make the uh, the grain farms like earlier. Maybe if I would have made the grain farms earlier. Plus, oh, they're getting demolished. Look at them all die. See, this is the way I like to play this game. I like to have my whole civilization just die. So is the population going up again? You know what? I think I overpopulated this place. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna fix this by here, we're gonna just demolish some stuff. I had too many people and not enough product. That's fine, this, gi this gives me some space to, space to work here. Anything that got too much. So see, the population's going up again. Uh, I still don't know how to connect this. You know, does this ever go away? I figured that this like would go away once this was like connected properly, but it seems like it's not. And then so I don't know. 
I don't know. I'm no expert. I, listen, I gotta learn more about this game. Anyway, I just thought it was interesting. It's kind of fun. I need to learn how to play it a little bit better, but if I do, maybe I'd come back and uh, do a stream of it. I just thought it was kind of cool, and nobody talks about it. So, anyway, alright, moving on. Okay, so here's a Dead Space game on the Wii. I didn't even know. So I played the original Dead Space, which I loved. I thought that was a great game. This one, no idea, but uh, I'll try it out, and if I like it, maybe we'll play uh, more of it later. But I'll I'll try it at least. Do you know if it's uh, this is a? Uh, is it one of these you play it like this? Do you play it like this? Oh, it's a zapper. Oh, is this gonna be just shooting the screen? One of those? Okay, well, I might like that. Okay, this is possible. Hmm. It's good. People are saying this is good. Okay, I mean, I'll try it. Don't get mad at me if I don't like it. Oh, hang on. Because sometimes people suggest games to me, and I might not have the same opinion, you know? Why is it not? Oh, I have to go to that, I guess. You ever had that happen? You have a friend, and they suggest a game to you, and then you end up not liking the game, and then you feel bad? So don't be don't be upset if I don't like it, because I've never played this before. All right, so I'll try it. Um, I'm gonna have to learn the controls. I'm gonna just do normal because I've not played it. And if I like it, maybe I'll come back to it later and we'll up the difficulty and whatever, so we'll see. I'm assuming you're moving through space with this and then shooting with this or something, and I guess we'll see. And thank you, uh, MastF2005, for the sub. Uh, sorry, Lexine, I was next to the recharging station. Are you calling about tonight? No, because then it wouldn't be a surprise. Sammy says, I don't know what a friend is, Mike. Why? And Megastar says, I never had friends with a crying face. And then they say friends with a question mark. So, should we, should we do this? How many people here would say they don't have friends or no friends? Well, you're, you're in the right place because, uh, you know, that's honestly, that's part of what I'm doing here. I'm trying to replicate. People ask me, like, real quick, people ask me why I do my audio the way I do. I do this in part because I like to replicate the feeling of playing games with friends, that couch co-op that's very much gone these days, I feel like. You know, not totally gone, but... Um, I feel like it used to be like in the 90s, you go over a friend's house, they'd be there, or you'd have a group of friends, and you'd all play games on a television. So, to my audio, like, I like to make it feel like you guys are in the room with me. So, I mean, that's part of it, is that we're hanging out, I'm just fucking around, and some people are like, oh, well, you're not, you're not funny. It's like, that's not really the point. It's just like, we're, we're hanging around. It's not, I'm not like a fucking stand-up comedian or some shit. It's just like, you know, it's like, because I have videos on the internet, I think people take it as like, I'm trying to be like, you know, if, uh, late night comedian or something like that. It's just I'm just hanging out with you guys, fucking around. You know, it's not like that's all it is. It's like hanging out with. That's all I'm trying to do at least. It's just you know, like hanging out with friends in the '90s. That's what this is supposed to be. You know, and you, you know what? It happened back then too. Your friends would make jokes, and they were bad jokes sometimes. Sometimes somebody would tell a good joke. But a lot of the jokes were bad, you know? So I, I'm not, you know, so some of this shit I say, I know a lot of this shit I say is not funny 
You know, and it, it's whatever. Who fucking cares? I know that. We're just hanging out. So fuck. Calm down. <laughs> Cyborg647, thank you very much for the sub. Appreciate it. All right, so let's see what we're doing here. So I guess this is a rail shooter. And at least I know some of the lore because I have beaten the first game. I have not gone through the second game yet on stream. I know I gotta get to it. All three of us downstream. If this thing gets so much stretch, Chief Barrow have us all scrubbing the events. I don't know if I have to do anything. I'll just let it go. Because I'm worried about, you know how like you can twist things in Dead Space to cut stuff? I'm like, am I going to have to do that somehow with this? You know, to cut the... I don't know if it's going to work like that or if it's going to be different. That thing's got to be man-made. Hurry up. Cooper's already pissed off that we're late. Copy that. I'm right behind you, Sterling. This is, also, isn't this kind of, this is starting at the end of Dead Space. Is this supposed to be like, it came a, it comes after if you beat the game? Guess all that target practice paid off, huh? Good job. Now get the Lotus arms in position. One of you TK, the other two rivet the joints. Egan, I'll take these two. And watch your aim. I don't want to end up on crutches like Matthews. Oh, they, they want me to like... Central to Caldwell. Those joints need to stay tight. Hold your rivet gun right in the hole. Nice job. Do that will work? I <laughs> hope. So they want you to... Alright, boss. Alright, Egan. Let's get this thing on board. So, I so I don't particularly love doing this motion with, with Wiimote games. So, that might be a little bit of a trouble for me. Sometimes I'll, like, hold it... Some of the some of the Wii games, I, I, pre, I prefer to hold, like, this with certain games to do like that as opposed to doing that... Like, after a while, my wrist starts to hurt doing that, so that might be a problem, but we'll see. Try. So, do I get a move? What do I gotta do here? What? This thing? Press A to pull items towards you using TK. Oh, look at this thing. Okay, so am I pulling this towards me? Ah, yes, I am. I got it. Almost there. Central to Caldwell. Keep your TK locked onto that loader, then slide it over towards the marker. Okay, I see. Looking good. Count and balance is... And the marker is this big alien cock. I'm starting to fire down. Press A to interact. You got it. You got it, dude. Four. Your cock is not? Well, I guess you're not an alien. That would, I, you're probably human, you're probably a human being. What the hell was that? Human. 
Come on, guys. We gotta get a move on. And Boopy Boop Six says, I like taking a dump up people's asses. That's always a thing that you can do. All right, let me try to. Do I twist? Oh, oh, that's all I wanted. I'm worried about the twisting stuff. Okay, activate, sure. I'm hoping we get to see some monsters here. Plus, plus to adjust options and view play tips. Okay. Let's get a thing without the lights. There should be a box of glowworms near our storage chamber. We can use them. You guys remember glow worms from the 80s? That's health, isn't it? How do I... I don't know. Shake the Wii remote. Oh, shake it. Okay. We good? All right, it's moving again, slowly. We should grab some supplies before we head down. Sure, I'll take that, I'll take that. God damn it. Captain's log. It's weird to be on a rail and not be able to just walk around myself. I kind of wish I could just walk around myself, but it's a different type of game. Something bad's gonna happen. Maybe. Shit. Sounds like someone's in trouble. Uh, shit. Wait a second. We don't know what's going on in there. All right. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck's name are you doing? Get off it. How many Wii games say fuck? Shoot you! You know these rivet guns pack a punch. Can I shoot him too? Help me! He's out of his mind, Sterling. It didn't let me like. Oh, there you go. Plasma cutter. Here, give me that. Oh shit. Oh. Should I kill this guy too? Oh my god. I can't believe this, Sam. Get that rock saw. We may need it. Sure, I would be glad to have that. Jesus Christ, we just killed someone. We don't have time to think about that. If we don't fix that tether fast... Top 50 Wii games that say fuck. Mario Wii says fuck. Look out! More of them! They've all gone fucking crazy! Oh, like New Super Mario Brothers, right? Yeah, I remember that. It's like if like Luigi falls off the side and then he comes in the bubble, right? He's like, oh, fuck! And it, and it keeps happening over. It gets a little annoying because he's just like, he says it so much. Fuck! I don't really know how to use the, I'm getting the health towards me, but I don't know how to pull items towards you, then press B to shoot them away, but how do you use it? I don't get that. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, guys, let's go. Tether 16's a few levels down. I had open lockers. I got plasma cutter stuff. Oh, you guys see that? It's blocked. 
Looks like they had problems down here before. This is a bad idea. We shouldn't have come this way. Sam, calm down. Cut that security line. Use that rock saw you picked up. Oh god, I'm gonna have to switch items somehow. Oh. Oh, you only have to, you can do that. That's cool. Huh. Here to stop people coming up. So that you guys can see me, I have lights above and I have a big like light over there like shining at me. And when I don't have the light on, people like yell at me. They're like, oh, I can tell you don't have the light on. Sometimes I get that. So you see this game, like how this looks. This is not the environment. Like I've got Ernie behind me. He's like, Rubber Ducky, you're the one. You make bath time lots of fun. Yes, you do, Rubber Ducky. You're my only friend. Do 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 do. We're in the bubble bath, Rubber Ducky. And I'm gonna do this song for like 15 minutes. But um, not the environment. I don't think for this game. I think you want the lights shut off, and you want to like be immersed. And you're then you turn around the corner, and then there's a monster. I got I got like 15 different monitors on, all like shining. Big Buck Hunter on Wii at me. Not exactly the ideal thing. They said fuck again. That's that's fuck number three. Sergeant, this is Cooper. Just checking in. How are you doing? We're making our way through the mega events, boss. Some strange shit's going down here. Now they said I shit. Excuses, I want that gravity tether fixed. Fuck and shit. Over there. Shit it's and coming. fuck. Isn't it amazing that it's fuck and right. shit is in a game like this? You ever think about that? I'll check it out and meet how, how universal Go. the words fuck and shit are. It's death. This is like probably millions of dollars, right, to make this game. They're like, you know what we need though? What are you talking about? Get a grip. Needs to, they need to say fucking shit a lot. Like, didn't we didn't we spend like seven hundred thousand dollars to make this? I know. We did. Now it should it, it only said fuck once. It should say fuck a lot more and it needs to say shit too. Take that plasma Because that's what the people demand. They want to kill aliens. Tell them to go fuck themselves. The plasma cutter is a precision slicer designed to cut small quantities. Cool. Okay. Aha, that's how you do it, huh? Rubber ducky, you're the one. Oh, you lost your gun, you dumb shit. What are you gonna do now? You're fucked. The fuck? What the fuck's going on? I just took his head off, is what's going on. Egan, you okay? Needs us. Needs us to, to make it home. Quit babbling. Hi ho! Do this and get out of here. Kermit the Frog here. Look out! There's more! Shit! Get behind me! Ah! 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 crazy. Everyone's gone crazy. Can I like This is not working out. I don't know. 
I guess it's just headshot. Is there a way to do like the the slicer thing? Like I don't know how to do that. It's not right. I'm like try I'm I'm trying to change it like the or I'm trying to play it like the House of the Dead. Oh, is something happening here? Okay. Oh, maybe they maybe they want me to do that shit. There. What if we do that? That helps quite a bit. There, can I please have that? There we go. Got a little help. So they want you to do more of that. Twist the Wiimote and fire. The thing on the screen doesn't twist though. Like, if I could just stop for a second so I could like fucking talk, like that'd be great. So like, right, so I'm pointed it and then I twist the Wiimote and see what I mean? Like, I feel like in regular Dead Space there's like the thing and then you're you you're like turn yeah it's like how do I explain this there's like the two like laser beams and then you turn it but this doesn't look like anything turning it's just like it's just the crosshair and then you do that and it's like there's nothing you would think that they would have a thing that makes it look like you're turning something you know unless I'm missing something oh you never played the mainstream series oh. So, how do I explain it? I wish I had the drawing board up right now. I can explain it. But basically, there's, like, imagine two, like, laser beams, one on top of the other, like, two lines, and then it's twisted so that they're horizontal. So it would be like if there's, like, an alien with the legs, you know, and then you have them twisted horizontal, and that way you could, like, cut their legs off. Or if you wanted to, like, cut them, like, vertically, you could do, you could do that kind of shit, which is really cool, and it's a great... Like mechanic, and I, I, I like loved it when I played it. But I would, especially like you know what I mean. So you would think like that looks vertical to me, and then you, it sh I feel like you, it should be like you turn it, and then it goes horizontal, and that's just like not how it is. So it's a little. That's what I thought it was gonna be, and that's not what it is. So I'm just like a little thrown by that. What's going on? It's just it's just different than I thought what it was gonna be. Oh, remember the thing that makes you go like in slow motion in the game? There's like the time slowdown thing and all that. It's been a couple years since I played Dead Space, so now I'm like trying to remember. But yeah, definitely set very much in the same area, you know. Okay. Just need stasis at the right moment. Oh, stasis. Here you go. Is that... Wait, press what? Oh, I just did it. Central to Caldwell. We're receiving a lot of static on your end. Use the stasis module to get past whatever's causing the interference. Oh, the mist kind of shit. How do we do it? What do I do? Do I have to twist it? Let me say hang on. Oh. I can do this. They want you to trace it. Okay. And then... Okay. There's like a lot going on here. It's definitely interesting. I wish I could get to an actual monster. That's like what I'd like to say. Systems are stable again. We're on route to storage with a marker. Meet us there, okay? 
copy that. Caldwell out. I mean, I guess the, so far it's been like humans kind of taken over. Maybe the health stuff is just being used automatically. And I don't know if they're being as anal about ammo in this as they are in the actual game, but I feel like... Or maybe it's unlimited, I don't know. But yeah, Dead Space is very, like, you gotta conserve your am ammo. Oh, wait a second. This is it. Sam, say that again. Hang on a second. Look, horizontal, vertical. This is what, that's what I fucking thought. So it was the, it's a different, it's the other weapon. That could be from the blast. See, so the other thing was like a bolt you think that's what's wrong with thing, the and this is the plasma cutter. All right, I had the wrong fucking thing on. All right, that makes more sense. So now let's try this. Stay away from me. There we go. Can I have that, please? So how do I open these? Oh, I, I, I like blew it up. So you have to use a shot to do it, I guess. All right, can I like, yeah, I'm gonna shoot him like this. Oops, wrong button. Sorry, I'm like learning my controls. His head comes off, that's pretty cool. You're going the wrong way. Sorry, I know it's probably a struggle watching me play this. I haven't played the game before, and Wii is not my usual thing. I'm usually playing NES games and shit, so cut me a fucking break. Now entering zero gravity. Warning, colony life support systems offline. There it is. Hope the anti-grav still works. So what, they want me to... Oh my god. There. Oh, so now we're tracing again, okay. Almost got it. where we're jumping and all that stuff. This See, this game does it very automatically where the actual game is, you know, you're doing it yourself. This is all automatic. I'm glad that it has the, the plasma cutter, though. I'm not a monster. I kind of wish you could flip it, like maybe like this, like just go like that, you know? Just do like left, like that to flip it, as opposed to having to do that. But. Oh shit. They didn't even give me a damn chance. Fucker. Fuck off of me. Yeah, take your fucking leg off. Here we go. Yo! Oh, that's what you want. All right, now we're getting somewhere. 
Canisters, I forgot, so you gotta... See, you know why? Because in real Dead Space, you can stomp on them. Remember how you can stomp on those canisters? And this, you can't do that. So in this, I mean, maybe there is a stomp, but... It seems like they want you to, um, We're not going to die. like, le whatever it's called, levitate the barrels towards you, and then... Like, whatever that's called. Uh, Tractor beam them into you, is what I mean to say, I guess. And then shoot them, and then tractor beam the item that comes out of it. That's how you take the... Oh my god. Was that... Did I just die? Like... Oh, there's all these guys. This is, like, supposed to happen in the plot, right? Shooting one of your own is never He's not even packing a gun. You're shaking. <laughs> this is the guy that's smoothing. Yeah, I got the plasma cutter. Do it, son. It's Only better. I can cut all their legs off, man. You don't even know. He's gone. Call Commander James and get Doc Skirella down here. He's gonna have a busy day. Sam, I love you. Okay. So that, is that like part one of this? Like next chapter? Well, it, pro it probably just gets, honestly, it probably just gets better from here because now it probably just start getting into like the actual like monsters and shit. So, I mean, this is definitely cool. I, I am supposed to be moving on. Skyward Sword, yeah. Long time ago. Okay, so there, yeah, these are all like mini games. So this, so this is an ice cream one. So I think I take this off for this. Um, so they, you like how we go from dead space to this? It's like two totally different things going on. Here, let me move this. I'm like blocking shit. Hang on. Um, I hope I wasn't like blocking that whole, all these games the whole time. So, didn't even let me calibrate it. It said not successful, so hang on. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, now I can do it. Hold it straight up. There we go. Okay. So you hold this straight up like an ice cream cone. And then you try to not let it fall. That's all it is. And it gets longer and longer, and you just sort of, you, you sort of just like wiggle it around with your hands. And you want it to be just like straight and long. And I know it's like waving around a lot, but you just gotta kinda, oh, and it snapped off right in the middle. You don't want that. So how, how much did we get there? Well, we're happy about it. 34 scoops of ice cream. Let's try it again. And you see, you see how far it can go. So what did I just get there? Like 30 or something? 24? I don't know. Oh, I don't know what it was. Oh, 
come now. Keep going. Third, that was 35. Was that better? That is about uh, 35. All right, let's see. Let's see if I can get it more than that. Hang on. There's other games, but I, I, I just wanted to try this one a little more. Let's see if I can get. Maybe I can get it up to 40. By the way, this is we. Motion play, I think it's called. Oh my god. Damn it. I got fucked up. I wish it would start quicker when you fuck up. I have to do it again. This is kind of addicting. Come on, we, I want, I want to beat 35. Alright, at least I got a little better. Alright, so that's my best. <laughs> so far. And you just can keep doing it and see how much you can get it to go. So that's that. So let's try another game. I mean, it's kind of fun. They're just like stupid little games. Uh, what else have I done here? This one. I'm not very good at this one, but I'll try it here. So, I have no idea how to explain this. Basically, you're twisting your body. Does that look like me at all? That's when my hair was shorter. I gotta like make my hair longer. So you, you turn the Wii mode, and it like locks into position when you get your body right. If that makes any sense. I don't know if I explained that well. The way you hold the controller, you can see how, how I'm holding the controller. You, you gotta like be able to get it into oh god the right position. So you gotta be able to move the controller any in any potential possible way that it wants. Like, you have to be able to flip it all the way around and, whoa. Like that. Does it make sense? I don't know if I'm explaining this very well, but. But yeah, just watch kind of what I'm doing with my hands and you'll see. I'm just like, imagine the Wii mode is this character's body, and you're facing the Wiimote in exactly the way the character's body would need to face, basically. It's definitely pretty interesting. I feel like it's a pretty good, uh, pretty good use of what, you know, you could do with motion controls. Like I said, like I'm not the biggest fan of motion controls a lot of times, but I guess a better way to say it is I'm not a fan of 
shit motion controls. There are games where it's fine, huh? Sometimes it can be good, sometimes it can be awful. Final stage. Uh, oh, I didn't. I didn't know what to do on that one. Is it over? one heart. But that's the idea on that one. It's pretty fun. You go to another stage after that, or is that just the whole thing? I guess that's the whole thing, but you can do it again and try to do better. But, I mean, I, I did pretty decently on that. Um, I remember that one. Oh, Teeter the Targets. Let's try this one. Um, so I like this one because you can do like this kind of thing. Yeah, I've, I've tried this before, but I'll start. Uh, whatever, I'll just start here. So you gotta take the the little marbles and fling them at these platforms and try to break them, basically, and it gets harder as it goes. So again, this one, you're doing like this kind of thing. A lot of these games, you know, change up the controls. I don't know if I also have to get these green things, if that's like an extra bonus or what. I might be missing out by not doing that, I don't know. Right, so we got two going on here. Like that shit, and then that one and then like that. Boom. Break the targets! I always love that in Smash Brothers. Remember the break the targets? I should stream just me doing all the break the target stuff. I, I love that in, in Smash Brothers. Probably my favorite part of the game was the break the targets. They could make a whole game just out of that. God damn it. Break the targets! Arknoid, we, right? So this is like the deluxe version of We Play. Yeah, I guess so. There's We, yeah, there's We Play, and then there's what is this called? We Motion Play or something? We Play Motion. Yeah. So there's, a, there's another one. And there's some there's some good things on the original like We Play. Like there's a matching one that's cool. that. Oh, shit. There. That one I didn't do too hot. What do we got here? We got me fucking up. Oh my god, what? Oh, wow. getting harder. Yeah, let's get it up there. Mm. All right, at least I got it there and now. Come on, all right. Yeah, it's definitely getting more difficult gra gradually. Let's see. Imagine if this had boss fights. 
How would that work? If they hit the ball, it targets that are, have eyeballs with laser beams and shit. You got the bronze medal. All right, so I, I don't know. So that's that one. It probably gets harder as you go. Um, what else do we got? So this one, um, I forget how to control this. Uh, So you have an umbrella. I don't know if it'll tell me how to control it again. And you open the umbrella and then the wind like pushes you or some shit. And you collect the gems. They could do something with Inspector Gadget with this. With his uh gadget umbrella or whatever. There's a mallet. Could definitely do like a gadget motion game. I don't know that they did any kind of Inspector Gadget uh, Wii game, but I feel like it would have worked. Because he's got all those gadgets, you could have probably done a lot of things with him. There's one where you could use his laser pen finger to like trace something, or you know, they definitely could have done something. Or so, and then his mallet would do like a whack-a-mole thing. The gadget copter. Well, the so the umbrella that he has would do the same thing that you just saw here. The gadget copter kind of be some kind of like flying level. You could totally do it. Let me try the next stage in this. Flip it up. Yeah. Oh, I was able to do it. Can I go for this one? Yeah. Oh, baby. Yeah. Nice. This is a good idea. Like, you can honestly, you can make an entire game out of this. This is a, this is a very good one. Like, nice, nice little idea here. Of the controls, which I have not done yet. I don't know if there's other moves and shit you can do, but I think there's a way to like get up higher somehow. I'm not really sure. Like, how do I get all the way up there? God, I almost did. That's the noise he makes. <laughs> to get up there. All right, at least I got that. So you, you get the idea, it's kind of cool. It's a, definitely a neat idea. I think more could be done with that concept. It's definitely neat, the pulling with the umbrella. So what else we got? Uh, treasure twirl? tried this. So you like, I forget how this, oh, I think you gotta like, oh, I know what you're, I know what to do. So you twist this and you turn. It gives me, this gives me vibes of, what's it called? Um, Game and Watch Gallery with the uh, octopus, you know? Where you're like Mario. 
Oh, motherfucker. They, they steal that? You can get it back, though. Shit, pickles. All right, motherfucker. Give me that. All right, so I'm, I got a little motherfucker. No, take that back. No! Give me that! Oh my god, thank god that was there. Get away! Did we get it? Shit! That stressed me the fuck out. So that's what that, you're going down, you're moving it back and forth like that. Oh my god. To get the treasure. <sighs> treasure twirl! I'm gonna try, I'm gonna try another. Alright, let's try one more. care that much about the gems. I just want to get the big treasure chest and then get out. Actually, you know what? I don't know if you have to get them all. I assume that if you make it back up with the big treasure chest, that's... Motherfuck! And there's the octopus! Motherfuck! Motherfuck! Oh, I didn't know this shit was gonna happen. Okay. It's a whole new fucking ball game now. Tricky. Motherfucker. <laughs> I like that they added that though. They're like, this is too easy. We gotta have like a fucking hentai come out of the ocean and go up your ass. Alright, so that's that. Interesting. See, there's all these different mini games and they're, they're all pretty interesting. Um, there, so there's this one. This is like the outer space one. And you're like putting together. Um, a space station. I don't know if I can do this. So, if you see the red balls there, it's, it's going to be hard to explain, but think of the way space works. It's not like rocketing something on Earth, you know? If you want to go backwards, you have to have something push you backwards, you know? So it's trying to sort of simulate what space is like. That's kind of interesting. And what you're doing, you, you know, you're controlling this little thing. Can I do this? I think I did it. You're controlling this little ship, but each ship has a piece of this space station, and you're trying to put the space station pieces together. like, you know, just different types of mini games. Let me try another one. Do this, but have it be Star Trek Deep Space Nine, and you have to put all, the entirety of Deep Space Nine together. Every single piece is a different piece. I would play the shit out of that. Or, the, like, you put the Enterprise together. Dude, make this a Star Trek game. Star Trek, uh, um, I'm, I'm drawing a blank. I'm trying to think of the name of the, where they built the damn Enterprise. Usually it's on the tip of my tongue. I can't think of it right now. I forget what it's called. Somebody will know. Utopia Planitia. Thank you. I was like trying to think of the name of it. Star Trek Utopia Planitia. And you do this, but you're building the Enterprise. Thank you very much, Brisbane. I'm gonna do one more. Space Dock. Oh, you could call it that too.
There's also these like lines. You can see this like line. You can, you can try to like also like line it up with these like lights. Definitely got vibes of uh, pilot wings a bit. See, I'm slowing down a bit there. I might not do this this time. I think I fucked this up. If I do this, it'd be a miracle. Oh fuck. So, I mean, that's, you get the idea. That's we play, or we motion play, whatever. Who was the most annoying character on Deep Space Nine? You know, I was not really a big fan of Dr. Bashir. Sorry. Um, but, um, yeah. Um, this one I want to show you. So they tell you what to do on each one here, and you gotta like choose. There's like different things. Okay, two lookalikes. A lot of them are like lookalikes, but then they start doing other things. The one I'm using. All right, so I'm that. Let's Again, this is regular we play. We play. Did it say lookalikes? Shit, I didn't read it. See, this is what you gotta be careful. I think the ones that are looking in another direction or something. Is that what it was? You have to really, you have to make sure you read. Too odd. All right, who are the odd ones out? Is it? Oh shit, not that. Wait. Where is it? Why don't I say it? Oh my god. Oh, it's you. I was looking in the back. Jeez. I'm bad at that. Oh, you and you. Because they're in the back. Jeez. All right, look alike. This guy and that guy. They have different shirts on, though. So it's not the colors of their shirts. I guess it's just the faces. The fastest one. You. Oh, if you do it quick, you get time back. Is it these two? Oh god. Those two. It helps when they're right next to each other. The fastest, okay. You. That one I did a good on. I got that really fast. Um, oh god, is it you and you? Oh my god. I don't fucking 
and see who it is. I, I don't have any idea. Who is it? I don't know who it was. All right, well that fucked me. What? I don't know. I don't know who it was. I'm sure. I'm sure you guys saw it. I don't know. Anyway, that's that one. Is there any other one on this one that I like? Um. The, like the pool one, they have you like going like this towards the TV and I don't, I don't like that. Same thing with this. Oh, you'll think, you know what, you'll think this one's funny. There's more on the other game than I, that I like, I actually like the sequel more than this one, but, um, this is kind of funny. Now, I don't know if there's a game that this might remind you of, but, uh... Thank you, uh, Sammy Shehole for gifting a sub to Jen. Oh. Motherfucker. Really? When do I sleep? Um, I have the same exact sleep schedule as the as a cat. So I sleep a lot. But at, but at random intervals. Usually when I explain it that way, people get it. God damn it, what was down there? Who knew that this was like not easy? <laughs> so you thought it was just gonna be combat, but no. Can I like make that explode? Yeah, okay. Oh my God, they're like drop, how he's getting dropped behind me. Fucker. Oh, so I have, wait a second. So A drops that shit. Okay, hang on. All right, I thought they were doing that. I, I was confused. So I'm dropping that. It's like a tennis ball or something. I, I'm gonna try this again because I was confused on what was happening. I think the B button is my bullet. Let, let me try this again. I think now I understand what's happening. Let me go. I hate how it doesn't let you just go. Seriously? There. Alright, that one's just to show you how to move. Also, I wonder if I did if I did that. If I do that, will it blow up the wall? That's one way to do it. I guess if there's motion by it. So you drop it down and then you get the fuck out, huh? Yeah! Oh, those are good. By the way, I also didn't know you could shoot so many of these. Oh, motherfucker. Oh, you motherfucking cock. Eat shit. All right, well now that I know you can shoot so many of those off, I should do better. I thought it was like one bullet at a time, it's not. Oh, I'm gonna kick this thing's ass now. 
I didn't know they let you shoot like a lot of bullets off. Holy shit! Well, I didn't know that was gonna start happening. Okay, well that just changed everything. Oh my god, that scared the shit out of me. Ooh, bonus tank. Oh good. This is this one's good. Okay, I didn't realize. I like this. Fuck. Thank you, hobby man Mike Ganning for the sub. You need a soda and a bowl of cereal? Does it make you feel like the early 80s? I hope it does. By the way, what would you guys think if I did a, 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 like a, an entire dedicated stream of just the Atari 2600 Pac-Man? Just for like three hours, just that game, nothing else. <laughs> I was thinking about it. Atari Pac-Man is best Pac-Man. I don't know about that, but... <laughs> Are there Atari flashcards? LOL. So there's a thing called the Atarmony. Atarmony. Wow. Uh, Atari Harmony cart. The Atari Harmony cart. And you can put all the Atari games on that. So yeah. It's not quite as advanced as like an EverDrive or anything. So, but yeah. I mean that's what they're. That's what exists for it. But anyway, so that's that's that. That one's pretty cool. All right, so here's a game I played before. This is Castle of Shikigami 3. Uh, so I guess there were other ones. I, I don't know a lot about the series, but it's a bullet hell, and it's on the Wii, and we're going to try it. So yeah, I have played a little bit of it before. There's a lot of different characters with a lot of different attacks in this. You got this first person. You got that attack. Let's look at them. That's kind of interesting. And then they do this spiral blade thing. I wonder if they'll show it. No, they're not going to show it, but she does like a blade thing. This guy. Like a spread attack. There's that. He sort of got like a straight, straight ahead thing. So she, like a witch. Then we have, uh, I've used him before. Like he has a thing where like a, a man comes out with like a bunch of like balls or something. Um, and then there's that guy. I don't know, so... I'm just gonna try the first character. This is definitely... There's a lot to this. Oh, if you actually click it, then they show the other moves. Right. Yeah. Um, let's get this going. So you know me, I like my shmups, I like my bullet hell games. There's one called Ivello, and there's even a sequel on the Switch called Ivello Swamp, I believe. So I, I tried that, I think that's Japan only. Um, if you know of any good shmups on the Wii, let me know because I would try. I would try out more. It seems like there's not all that many. It's not like uh, the Turbo Graphic 16 or the PC Engine where there's like a billion of them. But there are some, and you know, here's one right here. I don't know what's considered the best uh, Castle of Shikigami game or how many there were. I should look into the history of this. It's something that I don't know much about yet, but one day I will. I'll know all about Castle of Shikigame. I'll be the expert. Come back in five years and I'll tell you everything you ever wanted to know. I hope. 
That's probably not true. I'll probably know a little more, but not much more. This guy looks like a boss from Gamera or something. Look at all that money, yeah. All right, I'm gonna see what my bomb looks like here. Boom. What the fuck? Oh, is it just for collecting stuff? I don't know, it like stopped time or some shit. And then he disappeared into a vortex. Uh, I don't know what happened, but it was fucking awesome. <laughs> okay. I have no idea what just happened. I think time stopped. <laughs> what the hell? I'm very confused. When you first start shooting, it's like sort of those like circles, but then it turns into like a, a straight line attack. I wonder what the high tier players of Castle of Shikigami play as. What character? Are you, if you're watching, are you a high level Castle of Shikigami player and who do you play as? What do you like? If, if you are a high level Castle of Shikigami player and you happen to be watching this, what do you like best about this game compared to other shmups? You know? I'll say that based on what I've seen, it's got a, a, quite a few characters, and each character has their own unique attacks. It seems to be a good variety in that respect. Um, like, that's something you would want, a bunch of characters with a bunch of different attacks. So, I mean, that's pretty cool. And I feel like, you know, watching this, somebody's going to end up recommending Toho to me. I have played the Toho games and all that. I've even done some streams. I did the, um, some of the really early ones that were on, like, uh, the PC-88, PC-98. PC so I, I streamed some of those before, and those were actually pretty cool. And I have played some of the later ones and all that. Boom. So was that it? That Was that the end boss? That was pretty easy. I mean, it's the first one. That little logo, that Castle of Shikigami logo, I would do that on a shirt, maybe, but would people think it's a Hot Wheels logo? That's all right. I'm okay with Hot Wheels. If they thought it was Hot Wheels, that's fine. <laughs> I tried the Hot Wheels game on Steam, by the way. There's like a Hot Wheels racing game, and I looked at it and I was like, oh, it's kind of like a Mario Kart kind of thing. So I, I played it for a little bit, and it's different though because like, like gameplay wise, your cart like flips over. Where like if you're playing Mario Kart, that doesn't like really happen. And that in in the Hot Wheels game, like your car can like completely flip over and then you gotta back up to get back on the course. Mario Kart, you know, if you go off the side or something, Lakitu will put you back. But which really fixes the you know, the, the problem of, you know, the car flipping upside down. I didn't really like the car flipping upside down. I did that to save myself because I thought I was going to get, like, hit there. Oh, you when you pause it like that, you can, like, shoot away the bullets. That's interesting. Or bomb pause it, whatever. All right, so we got some kind of boss here. Money. Uncle Scrooge's money. I like that they explode into gold coins. I like that about video games, they make no sense. When do you ever see some, something explode into gold coins in real life? Maybe this, maybe a slot machine. That's about it. No, it doesn't even do coins anymore. It's like a ticket payout. 
right? So you don't, you don't even that's there's nothing anymore that does that. Are you guys old enough to remember when the slot machines would send actual money out? I think it's better with the tickets, though. Because, uh... I didn't like touching all the, the cash. Because it's like... You know, you're touching all the, these coins that other people have been touching. You're touching a lot of money. It's a good way to get sick. <laughs> you know? This, this is my uh, gambling commentary on Castle of Shikigame. It makes no sense. How about some gambling games on the Wii? Like Vegas Stakes. There, I think there is some shit like that. There probably is. Use the Wiimote to like bring down the slot machine handle. Or you can use it to like, oh my god, like craps. You could like you throw throw dice. <laughs> I wonder if something like that exists. I bet that exists. I bet there's a Wii game that does that. Like you pull the slot machine handle like that, you know. <laughs> that might be fun actually. With me, I, I like the slot machines that are like themed to things that I like. Like there was a match game slot machine, oh, no. and there was a uh, there's a Buffy the Vampire Slayer slot machine. There's a Lord of the Rings slot machine. I, I have spent entirely too long playing the Lord of the Rings slot machine, and I'm trying to always get the the Witch King to come up. You know. I want the the Aragorn bonus, and the Golem bonus always sucks. You don't want to get Golem. Actually, what you want to get, you want to get Frodo in the Lord of the Rings slot machine, because that that's like your 20 extra spins, and then you collect the rings. That's one of the best slot machines ever, you know. <laughs> you know, you guys know what I'm saying about be the best slot machines. They're like, Mike, we don't play that shit. We play Contra or whatever you play. I play that too, though. God damn it. All right, anyway. <laughs> that's that's enough. That's Castle of Shikigami. I would play more of that later. It's it's a fun bullet hell, and if there are more good uh, shmups or bullet hells on the Wii that I don't know about, let me know in the comments, and let's move on. All right, now don't laugh, but this is Luxor 3, and I know it looks stupid, and it kind of is, but... Uh, this is a game that you can just jump into if you like stuff like Columns and Tetris and Bust to Move and that kind of thing. It works quickly, easily, and it's just, you know, that type of thing. So let's just try this real quick. Um, adventure. Let's go. We're going on an adventure. All right, start a new game. Uh, so here we go. So it's just, uh, you're matching the colors just as you'd imagine you would be in uh, a game like this. That's literally, that's about all there is to say, <laughs> but I want to show it to you. See, I grew up with Atari games and that kind of thing, so look, so I got a red color, right? So let's get rid of that. I got a green, match the green, good. So we got a purple, get rid of the purples. Match the greens up. So you, also, you see my cursor? If you can see, you can put the cursor on top of the colors and boom, throw it, get rid of it. So the, the fact that the cursor is on there makes it e like really easy to like line your shots up. So you can do that. Done, boom, and they grab all the stuff. And then, okay, so this is like a, uh, you know, a, that was like a wild card ball. And so we got the reds. Here, okay, I'm gonna grab that and that. Oh, stops time. And there's like items like that that stop time and um, extra gems for points and things like that. All kinds of different pickups. Like, let's see what this does. Uh, I don't know what that one did. But anyway, boom, finish that. 
So I know this is not like... N nobody's gonna be rushing to play this just because I'm playing it, I know, but... Here's a game that nobody is talking about, and you'll be like, well, for good reason. Uh, you know, by the way, I was gonna play um, Resident Evil, um, like the rail shooting ones for this. I know that those are uh, good games, by the way, um, but I can't find my copies right now, so when I do, maybe I'll do a stream of it or something. So I wanted to throw that out there, that I am aware of the rail shooter, like Umbrella Chronicles, and uh, forget the name of the other one, uh, of Dark Side Chronicles and all, all that. I know about those and I wanna uh, play those eventually on stream. But yeah, uh, it's like, you know, this is also like Arknoid, one of those things. And I, I like those kind of games, like I like Arknoid. You know, and these more simple kind of bust a move, puzzle bobble type of things. So I know that these aren't for everybody, but if you like yourself some uh, puzzle bobble, if you like yourself some bust a move, if you like columns, if you like bedazzled and you're 85 years old. How many of you are watching are over the age of 85 and you like Bedazzled? Well, you've come to the right place. Do you guys play a lot of Candy Crush? Do you play a lot of Cookie Jam? What other kind of games like that are there? I don't know. I like that kind of shit. I like that kind of shit too. You know what? Listen. I've done the hardcore gamer stuff. I've done the, the Batman on NES and the uh, Ikaruga. I've done, I've done that shit. So I get to say that I don't mind Candy Crush, all right? I get to say that. So when your grandmother is sitting there playing one of her games, on her phone or the iPad or whatever. Don't be judging. Maybe she knows better than you do. <laughs> you ever think about that? Don't don't be don't be judging grandma, alright? <laughs> alright, we're gonna blow some shit up. Boom. Boom. And boom. Mm. Mm -mm. There you go. There you go. We're getting there. Oh, what's this do? This is some kind of bomb. Fireball. Oh, it just blows everything up. See, that's cool. Because that, you don't actually have to even match anything. I wonder how many people have beaten this game. How many people have beaten Luxor 3? I should fucking beat this game and be like one of the f six people on Earth that actually, like, beat this. How many recordings are there on YouTube of somebody doing a full, long play, beginning to end, of Luxor 3? I bet, you know, there's probably like a million recordings of people going through, uh... Super Mario All-Star. But I'm going to stand out from the crowd. And I'm going to do Luxor 3 Let's Plays. What if? Would you guys be really pissed off if my whole channel from now on was nothing but Luxor 3 uploads? Would you guys be mad? Anyway, I'm sure uh, this gets more difficult as you go on. Um, if you make stage one of two, how many stages are there? Somebody please let me know in the comments. Have you beaten this game? Are you the one guy that found my channel and you beat this game? No, really though. If it, what if there's like a thousand levels? I want to be the guy. Look, there's a store. Look at all the gems and goodies you get. What? Have you, have you ever unlocked all this stuff in Luxor? How about that? You can get a lightning bolt. I don't have enough to purchase that, though, apparently. Can I buy this? No, I can't purchase shit. 
But you can, yeah, I'll be able to purchase that later. Lotus Bloom. Let's do this, too. I should go in this until... I can't... Until the game kills me. Wait, level failed? Well, there you go. I guess I'm done. Uh, wait, let me do this. What happened? What was the problem? Level failed. What? What am I doing wrong? I guess the greens can't touch. Is this gonna end it? Okay, I did that side. I'm gonna do this. Does that end it again? Oh, I guess I made it now. That was weird. I don't even understand. <laughs> I don't even understand it. Okay. Wealth of Kings, let's say. You know what I noticed too? It's getting faster. I should bring this game to the podcast. So I do, a, if you don't know, I do a video game podcast called Talk called Talk About Games. Do you think Ryan would be pissed off if I brought this game? What if I brought this game for like six weeks? It was just this game over and over and over and I keep talking about like strats. <laughs> Luxor, 3, Luxor 3 strats. He thinks that I like lost my fucking mind. He's like, you know, Mike, uh, we already did an episode on that Luxor 3 game. You want to, uh, you think that's enough for that Luxor 3? I'm like, no, I got to I got more things to say. Do you like how I'm just like shitting on this? But I like, I do like like this kind of shit. It's fun. I don't know. That's why. That's why we're doing this. By the way, I also want to mention. I know that there's a lot of like game show games. I, some of the Price is Right games are like really fun. And there's like Family Feud games, and it's like, listen, there's a thousand something games on the way. I just wanted to do like sort of a highlight of games that I, I that I like here. I can't play every single game in one video, but please, like honestly, if there's games you think I'd like, even look at this, look at what I'm playing right here. As long as it's like, as long as I'm not waving my arm around, I don't want to do that. You know, please don't recommend those type of games. But uh, yeah, like 1,500 games or something on the way. There's got to be a bunch of like gems in there. Now we're now we're on Snake Mountain. So what's gonna happen here? Um, here I'm gonna. Oh, you can bounce it off that guy's ass. this. Oh, look how good I am. Look how good I am at video games. No, but it, it's a fun, uh, it's fun. Fun little game. Uh, seriously though, if there's like more games like that, like columns or that kind of shit, puzzly games, let me know because I like that kind of stuff. Let's move on. This is Ghost Squad. I like Ghost Squad. I have to play another game that I like here, like, because... Okay, so anyway, this is Ghost Squad. This game's great, straight up. So we're gonna we're gonna play this a little bit. I played it before, but we're playing it again because it's like this is what I like. All right. Choose your mission. Let's do this first one here. Mission one. Mission one. You're the Ghost Squad. Oh, no. 
and the reloading is the fastest in this. You don't have to hit the button when you're off screen or anything. It's just like, you just go like that real quick. Red, yellow, blue. Okay. I'm trying. Wait, cut the wire. How do you? Oh. Red. Is it yellow? Blue. Alright. Fuck. <laughs> Hulk Hogan. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, is that my own guy? Shit. I'm over here. Can I shoot all the everything else? Just destroy the whole place. What if you get extra points for destroying everything else? Probably. Shoot the wine bottles. Oh, fuck. Those are my own guys. Can they stop being in front of my gun? That'd be smart. Do 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 do. You gonna hide now, motherfucker? Oh, there's a good person? Fuck! Oh, I'm so sorry! Um, da. Sorry, I'm an idiot. It's my fault. And the flowers are still standing. I will destroy every piece of silverware! Restaurant area clear. We cleared the restaurant. Oh boy. Are there what, like 1,000 dudes in this cabin? Yes, and I'm going to eliminate all of them. Now what's cool about this is that you can keep replaying these because there's alternate paths. Eliminated. I'm bad in all these games at not shooting the good guys. It 
It's like that in every every game that I play. Like Red Dead, same thing. Okay, so uh, I don't know. Let's go in the middle. Don't have any good people. Oh, fuck. All right, that's a continue. Damn it. Oh, and he like there was there was a, a chat there was a uh, armor I meant to say not a chest there was a chest piece there was an armor piece I would have got that earlier So the ending of this is like there's a guy going after like the president and you get one chance to shoot the bad guy and if you if you fuck it up you're done from what I remember I need like health or something That's not the president one. I'm thinking of another mission or something. So also, so I basically went the middle way. So the other way, so the next time I want to go like the left side or something. Maybe, a, oh, this is the middle, this is the president one. This is helicopter, this is president, this is, so it's helicopter, plane, boat is what it is. Okay, here, let's let's do this. I, I fucked this up last time with the rescue the president thing. I'd really like to get by that. Alright, that's the pilots. Don't shoot them. See if I can find any like goodies like that. See that shit? I got some armor. I, I, I gotta do more of that, like shooting stuff in the background to try to. left. I don't think I've been in here before. Oh my god! Holy shit! Scared the shit out of me. Oh, is this the part? Alright, uh, right door. I don't know. Oh, oh. It's a 
severe turbulence. Yeah, I'm not helping in this situation, am I? Uh, the plane's like all fucked up. Maybe you want to like stop shooting. I'm gonna t end up taking the whole plane down, just killing everybody because I'm like shooting like this. Like, there, maybe you shouldn't do this. Maybe you shouldn't keep firing like this. I get one shot to do this, I think. I've never done it. That was it, I, I missed, that, you get one shot. You have to know the exact like timing on that. God damn it. So it's like when he comes out from behind that box. <sighs> God damn it, I wanna do that so bad. Uh, should I try it again? I'm gonna try it again. We'll try it one more time. Did I get anything here? Conference room, right door, boss. So I need to go hand-to-hand -hand left door, is that it? I won't do conference room, and I need left door. Choose your Let's, I'm doing it again. Mission aborted. I want, I don't, wait. Can I not do it again? Is it because I already did it? Do you have to go through all three of them? Wait. What? Do you... Is it gonna make me do the third mission? I thought I could do that again now. You have to like do all of them, I guess. That I didn't know. Mission start. Below my life is. Ooh, I got the truck. So, don't put them in front of me like that. So you have to like memorize everything. All right, go left, I don't know, man. I thought you could immediately redo the missions. I guess you have to do the whole thing. Also, like I played this before. I don't know if it's like saving everything. Like, I feel like I'm doing a lot of things wrong. <laughs> I want to know where to find like all these extra ammo things and whatever. So I'm just kind of shooting all over the place, looking for the like upgrades and shit. Cause I don't know where they are. All are. Ooh, got him quick.
Like, what about all this bullshit in the back, like these steps and stuff? Like that shit? You would think, right? Or not. Oh yeah, so this is where you gotta do like the A button stuff, if I can do it. I think it's the A button. All right, I did that pretty well. It's so easy, like this knife, like right in the back of the neck. Slit his fucking throat. <laughs> Motherfuck. Got him quick. Shot him right in the balls. I think you have to defuse bombs here if there were some shit. God damn it. Yeah, here's the defusing the bomb part. I think it's you use the A button on it. You like tap the A button on it. I, I used to try like holding down the A button, but it's like tapping it. So you like tap, 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 tap it really, really fast and then you clear it. You can accidentally shoot them. So you gotta be careful not to shoot them away. So that's clear. You can barely even see him in there, right? There's another one. Okay, I got that one. I think there's one more. There's, there's that one. There's this one. Alright, I got all of them. And then there's GS, which I don't know what the GS is. Gas. My guy's got gas. There's all kinds of things that I don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> just, just so you know, I don't know what I'm doing. Motherfucker. I'm over here. I think this is the one that's gonna have the boat at the end on the next part of this. Man, I, I just wanna do that damn plane again. I wish you didn't have to go through, I wish you could just do, keep doing the same one over. McCoy has no injuries. All right, yeah, here's the boat part. This part, by the way, speaking of hard, like forget the president part, this part's even harder. This I really haven't figured out. So this boat comes up and then like you get these grenades and you shoot the walls off and that's all, I can do all that. But then, I don't know, this guy comes out. Fucking hell, if I can get by any of this. Um, this guy comes out of the boat and he has like a rocket launcher and it's like, I don't know what the fuck you're supposed to even do. guys in the boat. Where are they all coming from? Like, there's no way. And there's nobody driving the damn boat. A load of bullshit. You see all the grenades that they're shooting now?
So I guess you gotta shoot it down and then, I don't know, wipe them out within 60 seconds. It's like. I can't even, I can't even see the fucking, here. They're in the air. Great! This part's so hard. I can barely see the damn grenades that they shoot in the air. That's the problem, I can't even barely see them. Fuck, come on. Oh, 60, oh, that's why. Because I don't get through that quick enough, and then I'm dead. It's because I'm too slow blowing up the, doing that. Jeez, that's hard. There was like two more after that. Fuck. <laughs> it's not easy. It's fun, but shit. Look at this. Now they're actual ghosts. <laughs> yeah, exactly. And this says mission aborted if you don't make it. So the only one I made was the helicopter one. So I failed all the rest. Do I get to save anything though? Like, or no? Let me get the cast and shit, I don't care. Here, let me see if it like lets me save anything. Maybe I always turn the game off too quick, you know? Okay, oh wait, so you you unlock new weapons as you go? Maybe that's why I'm not making it through this. Maybe you get better weapons, and then if, the more you play it, then you have better weapons and shit. Because I just unlocked a new weapon, I guess, huh? That makes a big difference. New Hive scores, connect to Nintendo. That doesn't exist anymore, right? <laughs> Wouldn't that service be gone a long time ago? So now maybe it's saved? Player level four. Okay, so now it's saved. Here, now I'm gonna do this again. Yeah, load it. So, private first class, so that's like my first run. I guess, I see, I played this before, but I guess I just never saved it. Or it said save below that. Fuck, was that my opportunity? Can I go back? Motherfucker. Is that where I had to save it? Oh my god, that means I have to play through the whole thing again and then make sure I save it? That can't be right. It already saved, didn't it? Guess I'm going through the whole fucking thing again. Now, now I'm like, I'm, I'm gonna do it again. We're gonna do it one more time. Fuck it. Here we go again. Oh, I'm gonna try to take different paths, though. I see I didn't go this way before.
So one got in. Damn it. Fucking crap, I shot one of the guys. I always do that. We're gonna have a hostage walk out now. I'm like hanging by a rope right now. This part again. So you always see this part, I guess. Oh yeah, I fucked this up last time. So there's hostages here, right? I gotta be careful. At least I... At least I saved one of them. The thing I'm the worst at is not shooting the hostages. I can't seem to not do it. Oh, eat dick! It's gotta be like health somewhere, huh? Oh my god, right there, hell yeah! Alright, I didn't find that before. See, that's the kind of shit I gotta know. That's gonna change the whole thing. Sorry, didn't mean to shoot you. Fuck. Oh yeah, this shit. Alright. At least I found health on the table there. I wonder if that's randomized. Or, that's gotta be the same thing every time, right? If it's randomized, then I have a lot more reason to not know where all that shit is. God. Motherfucker! Well, I probably would have died already by that point, right? Searching all rooms. Damn. Uh, the, the right one. I don't think I ever went in that one. Or maybe I did, who knows. Fuck! Yeah, I never saw this. this heat one. Infrared, whatever. Fuck! Alright, at least I didn't shoot him. Okay, I didn't shoot you. Maybe if I could have seen something. Okay, 
Okay. Oh, is this the helicopter part already? This, I mean, it's the first one. This is the easy one. I can do that, like, every time without a problem. All right, so I cleared that one. See, now it's, oh, did I go the same way on that? Oh, I didn't go, there's question marks in the restaurant. There's something in the restaurant that I'm not doing. Huh, there's like secrets or something, shit. I gotta figure that out. Choose your mission. Anyway, all right. Here's gonna be the Air Force. Mission two. If I can do it. Welcome, mission start. I got a, um, an armor there at least. Passenger seats, I did conference the other time. Oh, I, I like open something there. All right, hand to hand shit. Blow me. Crack your fucking asshole. Asshole. Oh. All right, hostage. that. Shit, sorry. I didn't mean to blow you away. Just, it just happens, man. I don't tell you. A metal? I saw that. Uh, left door this time. I didn't do this last time. What? gonna be the part? Yeah, all right. Fuck! Don't you know how to aim? That 
it's so hard to do. You get one shot, and he's like, he's like bouncing all over the place. Oh my god, I want to get that so bad. I mean, at least I went a couple other ways. I, like, I'm gradually unlocking like a little bit, but. You know what I need there? I need I need Dead Eye from Red Dead. Choose your mission. That's so hard to do. All right, I got one more. I gotta go through this. I'll just try to choose different ways. Hmm. Good morning, Mike. Star Trek Strange New Worlds is amazing. You need to give it another chance. I watched a few episodes. I'm good. I watched like the first three episodes, three or four. Um. Let me, let me know when Leonard Nimoy comes back. I'm good. That captain with his like, it's like it, it's like that. Uh, what's that? American Pie, where the fucking dude gets the cum in his fucking hair. That's what his fucking hair looks like. That like Captain uh, Pike. He's so got a fucking wad of jizz in his fucking hair. And then you have then you have fake Spock. It's fake fake Spock number two. We already have fake Spock number one back in 2009. Now you got fake Spock number two. And then you got Jizzwad. Jizzwad and fake Spock. I'm, I'm good. Let's go right. Captain. So far, so good on this. I'm gonna fuck the end up though, cause I can't. I gotta like, I gotta blow those walls up quicker. I, I know that there's those grenades and shit. I gotta use them faster, I guess. On that end part. This is the. I think this is the part that I do explosives crap. Alright, alright, alright. 
Yeah, 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 I get it. I've done it before. What the hell? That little... What is that? Oh, it's showing you that... I, I say. It's like, oh, you did that. And I, I really, I, I would like to try to beat this. But the part that really matters, anyways, is the boat. So here comes the, here comes the bullshit. Not again. At least the more I'm playing this, like, I'm gradually progressing, though, and maybe if I unlock some guns. Blow up! Yes. Ugh, this whole part now. Got a grenade coming up my ass. This is the wave runner guy? Yeah. Played enough, you know the positions before they come out. That's what you need, you know, to do this. You know exactly where everybody's gonna be. All right, is this the boat now? Yeah. I'll try. I suck at this. Damn it! It's all these other fucking guys. It's like. Now get fucking. This guy's over here. 12 seconds to do this shit. Come on, is it done? Oh, I actually made it? Now what do I do though? Did I make it? I have no idea what I do. I don't think I ever got to this part before. Okay, kill him within 30 seconds. I would love to. Am I hurting him even? I wonder, is there a secret to this? Dude, I don't fucking know what you do. Dude, 
Dude, suck my fucking cock. At least I got further. Maybe if you really do unlock better weapons, then I'll be able to do it eventually. All right, this is Sin and Punishment 2. Look at this, skippable cutscenes. You just hit plus and it goes by the cutscenes, which I'm a fan of because I like to get in, right into the action. As you know, I, found, I, I sound like a broken record, don't I? I'm sorry, but it, it is just so nice. Uh, all right, so move your character around, fire your gun, all that good stuff. All right, so you can like lock on to a bunch of stuff like that and blow things up, which is really neat. Um, Look, you got a hoverboard. It's Back to the Future. Uh, um, I wonder if that was influenced by Back to the Future, actually. So, Sin and Punishment, um, I've streamed the first game, at least some of it. So this game was originally on uh, Nintendo 64, and I did a stream of that quite a while back. And I had trouble with the controls, for sure. I feel like, so I'm playing this, you know, with a Wiimote pointing at the screen and a nunchuck, and I just feel like, from what I've played so far, um, this feels like easier for me to uh, play with. Um, so I feel like I've been enjoying this one a little bit more than, in, than the Nintendo 64 version of the game. So if you hold down stuff, you can like lock on and let go and it blows everybody up. And then you've got this like sort of, uh, sort of dash out of the way that you can do, and that's the Z. And with the C, you have jump. <laughs> but also, yeah, or you hit up, and then she does this, like, uh, hoverboard thing, which I, I think is kind of kind of cool. And it actually works pretty pretty well. It's not, you, you would think that that would be, like, hard to do or weird, and it's, it's really not. It just kind of works, uh, I don't know, for me, it, it works well. So, yeah, and then I can do, oh, I think they want me to jump. Oh, crap, like that, ah, crap. And then I can sort of dash to the side, get out of the way of stuff. I don't know if that's considered a dash. I don't think it's a dash. Yeah, this is the hovering. So this is the first level. This is like the tutorial. They're just showing you the, the level. See, look at that, how she can like hover over stuff. It's, it's neat. So this, is, so you're locking onto multiple enemies at once, and then letting go, and that's like sort of your bomb attack. And I, I think that's stronger than your regular. Uh, so the B button on the Wii remote underneath that is like if you just tap, or if you just tap it once, you do like a melee attack. But if you hold it down, she fires. So it takes like a second to get the fire going. But so I'm like holding it down, you can fire. I think this is health, maybe. Adv oh, advanced evasion, many attacks that can be, that seem unavoidable can be dodged. Yeah, so it's the dodging, so it's like, I think they're talking about that. So this is the lock on, and I think the, the longer you lock on, the, the stronger the attack is, which is kind of cool too. And then, you know what, I think they actually, crap, I think they want me to dodge through this. I'm gonna practice that. Yeah, I think they do. So yeah, to get through that, it's like, man. Yeah, you, they want you to dodge through there. I'm blowing up the crap on the wall. Boom, and then you blow up. This, this very much reminds me of Contra. You know. It's like that classic running through space area in Contra. So I'm like locking on and letting go. See, and then we go forward. A, a really just well thought out use of motion controls, in, in my opinion, this game. There's quite a few games that are <laughs> really not well done, but this is this is like the kind of thing you want. And it's great for me because I felt very intimidated by the Nintendo 64 game and the, w the way the controls were. I played it for like hours and I, I started to get used to it a little bit, but it was it was tough, uh, you know, to get the controls down in that. And I never really fully did. But th this is just like, I can just pick it up automatically 
um, and just I'm going. So that's that, that's that's and that's what I like, you know, just to be able to pick it up and pick it up and play, you know. At least that's for me. I wonder if other people would have a different experience. Like maybe somebody else would have have a hard time, but I don't know. For me personally, like I was able to just pick this up and pretty much start playing uh, right from the get go. So it's nice. So I can lock onto all these guys, blow shit up. And then if there's a cooldown on this, you can't just like keep doing that over and over. You gotta wait and then let go and do that. It's so neat. And when I think of like what I would have wanted for the Nintendo Wii, like this is exactly the type of thing that you know that I that I the type of game I would want. Um, I did not own this game back when I had the Wii originally. I had what games did I have? I had obviously I had like Twilight Princess. That's probably the first thing I got like into on it, which is fine. I'm, I'm not including any Zelda in this, although I might do some uh, Link's crossbow training soon. Um, I think that's the last. See, you have these little like anime cutscenes, but if you don't like them, boom, you just skip right by them. And that, that's great. See, that's that's what I want. Look, look how cool this boss is. By the way, I, I'm only playing on normal right now. I'm sure you can play on like harder difficulties and whatnot. So. I'm just learning how to play the game. I want to actually do a full stream of this. Um, I, I think, because I, I just, uh, I think it's really, really neat. I don't know if this game was Japan only or if this was released in the U.S. If this was not released in the U.S., that's that's really a shame. Uh, I, I hope it was, but uh, but yeah, this is this is definitely really great. All right, so I'm going to dodge through that. I'm just getting the controls down and whatnot, but this is something that I can see myself playing like over and over and over. Sort of like that Ghost Squad. It's like I just play that over and over, you know, and try to do better and better. So this is just one character you can be, too. There's, there, there is another character um, that I haven't tried yet. So I don't know what the deal with that is yet. Look, ooh, look at me hover around. I, I love the little hovering. It's cool. Oh, this isn't over yet. Boss is still going. Look at this, now we're flying in the air. Like, this is awesome. And I don't know, I never hear anybody talk about these characters. And hell, did, did they ever make a... Sin and Punishment 3. Like I don't I don't know if they ever did another one after this. But I don't know if I would even want like another Sin and Punishment if you couldn't have these controls. Like this isn't this is like could, could it be just as good if it was like on the Switch? I feel like you need these uh, awesome I, I, this is this is a situation where I'm going to say that the 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 nunchuck and the Wii, it, this, it makes this awesome. Like, I want it to be like this, you know? I wouldn't want a normal controller for this game, which is uh, quite the statement on my part, because usually for most games, I'm, I'm more like, oh, I want the classic controller. This the game makes me want to use these. So that's, that's saying a lot. Because usually, usually that is not the case. All right, so uh, you got a new high score. Upload the score to the online leaderboard. I'm, I'm guessing the online leaderboard doesn't exist anymore. So I'm going to say no. I'm going to do one more level. Oh, my battery's getting a little low. I'll play until my battery runs out. How about that? <laughs> no, I'll just try to see if I can make it through this stage. All right, here we go. Stage two. What do we do now? I guess you have to watch this part. Oh, it, that was it was only like two seconds long. So I'm locking onto all that stuff to blow shit up. Look at all these guys. Look at this shit. They're called keepers, I guess. The, the things in Resogun are also called keepers. How many games have keepers in them? Hmm. But man, look at these graphics, like... It's, 
it's just like, I'm just very impressed by this. This reminds me of like the end of the Avengers when the aliens are like attacking and shit. Did I just die? Oh, I'm good. I'm alive. Barely, but... Got a little coin. So there's all these little, like, secrets and pickups and shit. So are these, like, alien fish floating all over this guy? I feel bad killing them. They're not attacking me. Maybe I shouldn't... It should be, like, a penalty for going after them. But I think that's there for your like multiplier or something. It's to keep your like maybe it's for your to keep your multiplier going, I don't know. Maybe that's why they're always there. Blowing up the boxes, I'm now doing this shit. Boom. So I'm guessing that the other character that I haven't played as yet must also, I guess, have like a hoverboard because how would this character, how would, how would he get through the stage if he didn't have a hoverboard, so... I'm curious to find out the uh, difference between the characters. If there is any uh, gameplay difference, or maybe it's just uh, cosmetic, I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna do the lock on. Boom, blow him up. See, that kind of fucked him up. And then, can I do like a... Oh, how do you do the... I forget how you do the melee attack. Isn't it just A, I thought? Maybe it's not. Or it's just... Oh, it's just tap. Sorry, it's just tap B once. That's what it is. Sorry, trying to get these controls down a little bit. Boom, blew it up. And I don't think that that's even the stage boss. It keeps going. That's like a mid-boss. That might be an interesting video. How about like top 10, top 20 mid bosses? Everybody's always wor worried about the final boss or the, uh, you know, the stage bosses. How about mid bosses? What are the most interesting ones, you know? Because there are uh, a lot of games that have mid bosses. And sometimes it's, uh, you know, the games where it, like, fakes you out, and you're like, oh, I beat the boss. Oh, wait, what? That's only the mid-boss? So that meter there that's all red, um, you have to wait for that to go before you can use your, like, whatever the other t attack is, like the this, where you can, like, lock on to everything, your lock-on attack. Not exactly sure what it's called. All right, so now we're getting this eagle guy, I guess. And that's definitely quite a bit stronger. This is like, a, yo, this is like the end of Star Fox, where the thing turns into like that cat face. That's what that was reminding me of. And I'm like Fox, I'm like dodging out of the way and shit. And we're, oh, we're still going. That was not the end. That was not the final boss. Holy shit. I definitely thought that that was the end of the stage. And that's cool. It's still going. So the stages actually have some, like, depth to them, you know? So you get, like, two mid-bosses, I guess you could say. Unless the whole rest of the game is just this level. And I'm... Maybe I'm in for a surprise. They're like, um, no, Mike, there is no break for the rest of the game. Could be. I don't know. I'm no expert. Not yet. I, w I would like to be an expert on this game, though. Boom. Come on. Boom. Hmm. I don't know if there's any moves and stuff that I'm missing out on that I'm not doing, so please don't yell at me. This is like my first time really playing much of this. 
So I'm saying I'd like to do a full stream of this later. Now I'm thinking like how long is this game? I'm, I'm guessing this can't be like a super duper long game. Blow up these things. Look at this shit. Alright, I'm gonna do some locking on. Boom! And it's so much fun too. Also, I have to say, uh, like the pointing, the you know, it, it works really well. Some games are a little wonky with like, uh, how do I say? It gets like a little jittery in some games. The, like the pointer. There's a few that I played where it's just like, it doesn't. It's not like smooth. This is like super like smooth. This is the boss. You know what? I'm wondering, uh, strategy-wise, if it's a good idea to like stay on the stage longer and sort of grind these guys. Like, if I take out all these other guys, you know, before killing the boss, that might be a thing. I don't know. Then again, you don't want to die, you know. But if you get good enough to dodge out of the way of stuff and you're not getting hit. I don't know. Look at this now. Holy shit, look at this. This is the boss. So this is not even hurting him at all. I think you have to hit him with this weapon. There you go. Because the rest doesn't even work on him. So, you, so I'll take out the other guys with my regular shot. And when I'm charged up, then I, then I do it onto the main dude. Like that. I guess. Something like that. Get out of here, fucker. Boom! Got him. And that's the boss. Two fake outs and one real. Let's take a breather. Oh, what's happening now? Ooh, evil things. Well, I'm gonna leave that until later. Um, I would like to do a full stream in this game. Very cool. That's Sin and Punishment uh, 2 for the Wii. Um, so, if, I wanted to say, if you guys have any suggestions for other games that uh, you think that I might enjoy, you know, based on... I like a lot of these, like, rail shooter games and whatnot, but if there are games... Um, I'm going to come back and stream this later, so I know it's still going on. Um, if there are games that you think that uh, I would enjoy, besides the obvious ones, your Mario, Zelda, Metroid, you know, the stuff that, you know, like Smash Brothers, I know, like, all that, but, like, more, a little bit more obscure games that people don't talk about as much. Uh, based on what you've seen here, like, in this video, these were all games that I enjoyed. If there's other things out there that I don't know about, you think, you know, I, I might like it, let me know. I gotta say, I don't... There was a game called, like, Mad World, for example. People were like, oh, you should play that. I tried it, and there, you use, like, a chainsaw, right? And, like, there's a lot... You're, like, doing this. I don't like a lot of the games where you're swinging the Wiimote all over the place, like, too crazy. I can do a little of that. Um, but I don't want to be like this the whole time. I, I like more just being able to sort of, like, point and click at things. Um, but yeah, uh, hope you enjoyed the video, and uh, let me know, leave comments, and let me know if there's other good Wii games uh, that you know about that I haven't played here yet, and maybe we'll play more down the line. And the video, and the games here uh, that I did enjoy, I'm hoping to do full streams of uh, some of them later. So thanks for watching. Bye.